Alright, can y'all hear me? Alright, yeah, Jordan, there's no sound because I was, I was muted. <laughs> Alright, let's rock and roll. Alright. So we're going to be uh, getting ready to, I guess, go to a meeting and everything and see what we're on today. But we are on as marshals. Um, Bob, he was not, he would not be here with us today as a marshal. He is out of town, so he would not be here tonight. Dirt, he is live. Um, Joker is live. So those two will be live, so you can check them out. I think uh, Joker is actually live on YouTube. Anyways, how's how's everybody doing today? And yeah, we hope we uh we hope we catch some bad guys and stuff. I don't really know what we have planned or anything like that, so it might be exciting or it might be some investigating or it might just be just chilling and everything. So let's uh let's see what's going on with everybody. What's your bite? I think. Hey. Where's uh, where's everybody at? I don't know. I was the same thing. <laughs> That's a cop. Maybe in there. I know it's a uh, person in there. Oh, you're the, you're a trooper. I was like, what the heck? Yeah, I'm here for the meeting. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, let's see if I can find you. Oh, they're over here. What, what, what's, what's going on? I see a trooper here. I'm just waiting. I heard that there's a meeting, so I didn't know. Oh yeah, the meeting's not yet. The meeting's not the meeting. Hey, how you doing? Probably about a uh, How's it going? Hour. Can I help you? Uh, I was called here for uh, a meeting. Yeah, you go ahead. We'll be on the radio here first. Okay, everybody's here for a meeting that I don't even know about. Uh, and then, uh, we'll That's, that works though. Okay, good. um, I, I guess just wait over there at a chair or something. I don't know. Ten cool. Hey, we got another guy here for a meeting. <laughs> What are you here for? Who are you? What's your name? There's like... Right, there's there's like need to move it out in the spot. I'm moving there's like people, right ev every, oh, yeah. no, no, no. everybody here and everything. Check it out. We uh, we did some uh, little work to the old rim. We got that matte, like, desert tan and put some rims and stuff. I know the rims might not be everybody's cup of tea. I mean, it's really not mine, but, you know, you, you only... Like, I'd rather have, like, a 10-inch lift with, like, 40s. But this is what we're rolling on right now. It kind of looks not like a cop truck. What's up, Diesel? How's it going? What's up, Josh? What's up, Rockstar? Um, how many... Oh, wait. Hey, man, how are these? <laughs> uh, what's up, K, my boy? What's up, Brian? My day actually went pretty good. I kind of took the day off. We chill with the kids and everything. We, um... Uh, we set up like a little fort area with the kids, everything. So uh, we had a a fort, I guess, is house or whatever. I don't know what you call it. But we did that and everything, right, and it was pretty quick, good. Uh, quick update and the and uh, the, yeah, uh, conference room. Yeah, yeah. Right. I don't even know what this is. Is there an age limit? Yeah, I think it's 18. Oh yeah, we getting ready to get us popping here. Alright, let me uh, jump on this radio. Um, I don't know. Um... Dirty Max, like, I'm not staff or anything, so I have no clue. You'd, that would be, like, it'd be, like, a staff question or something. I don't know if I need that, though. Where's, uh... Alright, let me call... I don't even know where Dirt is, let me call him. You know, we got them, uh, you know, I had to put uh, game chairs in here. Old needle. I've tried to call them. Is he christening with his new office or something? Dude, I don't know what he's doing in his new office. Tell him, put it up. Get in here. And play with it later. 
He's not even answering. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you go get it. You brought him in. You can go get him. Where's she? Hey! I'm about to just say grab him. Hey! Needle! This is the big old dirty slinger here. He goes, can you switch? Is you? We are, yeah, we're, we're, uh, we're a sheriff, or a marshal. He wouldn't answer, so I brought him. Is he? Hey, wait, did he use the needle? <laughs> I don't know, I don't know. Like, <laughs> oh, hey, man. needle! Needle. I think he used it. I have no clue. Hey, so what's uh, what's up with the uh, other uh, other officers? Is that like a whole different meeting? Was that yeah, cowboy yeah, and meet? Was he officer? Uh, no, the cowboy's the undercover. Oh wow, he actually looks pretty. He looks like Doug Demodome. Yeah, yeah. I guess he's not used to being undercover because he doesn't look that uh, incon inconspicuous, you know. Yeah, Doug Dimonome was a. Yeah, still Dimonome. Exactly. You know who I was talking about. All right, well I guess we're good. I don't, needle, he eats. I don't know, like. All right, well when he comes back, you can update him. So the guy inside the red suit looks like uh, Lucifer from some TV show. Uh, is the DA. So the guy we had, we've had a guy undercover for a week. Uh. All right, so we got a DA. Yeah, uh, then. That's what we've been waiting for. So now we can actually start uh, pushing stuff a, that we I find to happen. Cameron, he's been on vacation, so we have an update regarding that, regarding the troopers and the cartel. And we need to go find this uh, chick that's been lying to us. Hey, I got I got her number. Hey, see if she's around now. <clears throat> yeah, well, I can. No. It's no. busy. Alright, well, the email I got from Cameron confirmed that he was given bribes for weapons to, uh... He's not doing anything to, uh, here uh, right shooters. now. It, it'll probably... Uh, he paid $100,000 for a pistol. Be here soon. Uh, the storm. rest of it was gifts, is what he said. Uh... Cartel. He gave a name. He confirmed the name that we have. The Sean name is one of the leaders of the cartel and they've been splitting profits 50 50. he wants to make a deal to not have to go to prison for a very long time wait so who's been splitting profits cameron who works down at that shop now is that the owner's son yep that's the owner's son the one that the owner said he didn't know what the crap that his son was doing. And he would save his business yep. for his son. But yet he's also yep. co-owner. Precisely. I mean, what's, uh, his, yeah. what's his offer? No, he just wants something from us. He don't want to have to go to jail for a long time. Uh, Diesel, no. Bob is out of town. Like, actually out of town. So he won't be on. What's up, American Death Trap? What's up, baby bear? So that's, that's what we have for that one. Uh, DA will need, will, will need you uh, to give uh, permission for uh, some, some more information. Yeah, I can write something up to get you guys a warrant if y'all need one. All right. Now the undercover, uh, you want me to go ahead and bring him in? and see what he can tell us about this cartel. What's up, Trex? Um, I guess. I mean, did he find anything out, or he's just been, like, with the thumb of his butt? He's going to tell us everything he found out. I mean, if his thumb's been up his butt, he can go to jail now. Rufus is actually that guy in the cowboy hat, which is Billy. Yeah, Billy is starting. He's oh, he was going to live stream a, tonight on uh, on YouTube, like he last time. but he just made his YouTube or something and wouldn't let him upload or uh, live for twenty four hours. So next time he should be. To be honest, that whole company needs to be shut down. Like I mean, 
If he has, if he has proof, I'm gonna need some. Well, the o like there. literally the owner like was like, oh, I don't put money in the bank account, or whatever. Like, so they don't pay no taxes or anything there. Like that whole entire place is like crooked. Yeah, we're gonna. Uh, I'm gonna look into it, man. I'm about to get a copy of her books and stuff like that, you know. And to be honest, like everybody else, like uh, was that uh, uh, Nikki and all them, like they. I mean, if they've got money in their account, like all of them work there, and they've got a substantial amount, you know, they were doing something crazy because you ain't gonna make a ton of money like doing a tune-ups. Come on now, remember Fast and Furious. Yep. Ooh, I love that movie. Tuna, tuna sandwiches don't make you a millionaire. All right, step up a little bit longer. <laughs> Is that better? Yep, so you've been undercover with the cartel for a week. What you got for us? All right, so in fact, uh, cartel leader's name is Sean. Um, he's got two people that run for him late at night. Uh, they run from Polito down along the side selling drugs on the beach. Um, when they do, or the cartel leader actually is the one that makes all of the drugs. Um, and then he distributes it out to two of his other people. I wasn't able to get the names because they're, you know, deep down in there um also i guess you guys already know nikki is running drugs for him too as well so he gives like three or four hundred baggies to her and she goes and sells them and then brings them back the money and then he washes it for her and then uh once he gets done washing it then there's a certain cut that they do and I'm, I'm not privileged to know that if that makes sense so that is what i have found out i'm gonna attempt to maybe try to find if you guys want to keep me undercover that's fine find out the two guys' names but if not that's that's fine also wait what's the two guys' name again what what, what repeat I, that part <clears throat> i'm not 110 percent of what the guys names are because they're i need a pen and paper <laughs> if that makes sense so i only met yeah, yeah we we know one of them yeah Go ahead, sir. Sorry, to my right. No, we know one of them. I have an idea on this second one. We can go find that. Well, out. you said well, one of the guys' name was Sean. Do we have a last name? No, he will not give me his last name. I have so, the last name once this uh, trooper leaves. Yeah, all, all I know is his name's Sean. He's the ringleader of the cartel. So, how many meals he got? Like four of them? So, he's got two that he calls his really good friends. And then he's got Nikki just on the side doing some shenanigan work. So she's the mule mule, the others are in. Yeah, so Nikki's the mule, and the other ones are actually in the cartel. So are they, like, moving serious money, or do you not know how much? Um, the last time I was involved with that, which was the mule, which is Nikki, um, she brought him 300 and something thousand dollars in dirty money. Yeah. How so, many times do they make runs? I mean, I'm about to say the same thing. Well, is this okay. like it took her like a week to do this or what? No, well, I don't know exactly how long I know he dropped off baggies and it was like the next day or so, and um, she had 300 and something. You're right, trying to sing so, 11, um, 13. Yeah, now. I'm yeah, not get that crap right. off the street. Yeah, so and it's all coke, so Most they're riding coke anymore. and the strictly coke. Uh, they're trying to sign me in the, the no, black marshal shirt. She was caught up with uh, cocaine. Wow. She was, she was hiding it uh, in a very, you know, certain place. And of course, ain't no female officers to do a full search. Yes, sir. One of y'all gonna have to one. put a wig on next time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Larry put a wig on and did it. That's how he knew where the coke was. But, you yeah, know, um, unfortunately, <laughs> that's all I could uncover um, at this time. Um, but I do know that they're making pretty good, decent money. Um, He's got flames. They're not making no $10 million yeah. dollars money. But they're making... Damn near. She's bringing him 300 a pop. Yeah, but that's also, like, I think he said, like, three to 400 baggies. So I don't exactly know how much, if you were to sell 800 baggies, how much that would be. Cause no, Chin is uh, Joker. Selling. How often... Um, 
How often are they running this a week? Do you know? Like, is, is this like a daily thing or a weekly thing? Um, so all I know is what happens is he'll go and make a bunch of it and he'll, he'll, he'll split it between his two inside men and then the runner. And then however much they make and how much she, well, they keep her separate because I guess they have a deal with her. I'm not 100% sure what the deal is because they won't tell me a whole lot because they still think that I'm working with you guys, if that makes sense. Um, so the only thing I know is the last time we met up, she literally gave him like almost two hundred to three hundred thousand dollars. Well, it sounds like you're going to. Have to do so are is, now are they still like? Is this all going through that business? I mean, that garage there, or okay? So Slipknot is not connected in what because I I played both, so I played. I played trying to get into the cartel, which I got into the cartel a little bit. Um, and then the garage, they don't, they ain't doing nothing. Like as soon as I guess Cameron hasn't been around. So the garage hasn't had no business whatsoever. So on that part, far as the, the, the garage part, they're, they're not really in connected. So no, I mean, is anybody there that works there like in this or just, they're just the workers? They're just workers. I mean, far far as I know, and how much I was able to press. But like I said again, they just think that you know I'm working for you guys and doing whatever that part. Well, I'd I like don't know. to. I'd like to try to keep you undercover, man. Get as much information as we possibly that's can. That's what I was gonna say. Um, he actually did really good, like to be honest. <laughs> like under undercover, uh, he the actually most stupid would be taking one of you guys hostage and then sh shooting you. And then they would actually trust me and actually. Yeah, that's me. that's not gonna happen. No, we can actually, we can have Larry stay under. Uh, Boston, because he he can, did can I talk post to you for a second. He did post all over social media that he got fired. Listen, boss, can I talk to you about something? You can talk to all of us. Go ahead. Uh, off the record. Okay. DA, stop writing. No, 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 no. Off record, as an off record, completely off record. Come, come like, with me. Come with me. Hey, I think we need a subpoena like that uh, to get the bank records from that Nikki to see how much she's made. Because if she's just getting a small cut and she's like loaded, when well, right there tells you like they're they got money. Well, it sounds like somebody needs to get on her tail and find out where she's going and what she's doing so we can get a hold of the person she gets from. So, hold on. She's she's still making money from there? No, oh, no. She's the shop, she does the, the run and everything and sells it and then gives it to them and then they wash it and she gets a percentage of it. Oh, okay. I'd like yeah, to she... try to put a tail on her if we could. And maybe, I mean, I know I'm coming from a DA standpoint, but maybe if we can get one of these undercover guys to try to, you know, Man, butter that's up for another word or something. But it's like we gotta get we need to get pictures and everything of her like actually selling and everything is a thing. Right, because I would like to like bring her in like for questioning. That's the problem. We keep pressing her. I mean she's gonna pull away. We kinda need to let her keep doing her dumb shit. So we well, can get I mean, people she's getting to. Yeah, I mean like professionally, like, you know, take her into custody. Like actually put her in jail? Yeah until she wants to talk if there was some way we could like flip her to work on their side like man we'd have this in like a week we'd have it in the books well, well i thought we that's like. what we did well <laughs> now she's on our side to get back at slipknot but not her connection well i mean the thing I is so if he said that basically slipknot really doesn't have anything in this i mean except for like the the workers i mean you know they ain't got nothing into it it's like there's really nothing getting back to them if unless she's like blaming slipknot but to get you to look away from this side, you know? Yeah, but I mean, that's what I'm saying. It's just, to me, it's if like we, she wants to bury them because they did her wrong. But that's about it. If we can prove that she's doing something, I mean, we could physically possibly arrest her for that and hold her for a little while. But I mean, I don't think, depending on the charges, you wouldn't be able to hold her long unless we did a 5150, which you know is the medical standpoint. You don't think her physical health is. And the best but we can get, man. Let me tell you what. If we want her in jail, we can get her in jail. We we'll oh, find yeah. stuff on her. 
Oh, she's already trail bound. We was trying to use her, but at the precisely same time, like I mean, ain't she, she out on bail? Yeah, right there. She's I more mean, focused on burying them than letting go of her tax. So it's almost like if we don't let her bury them first, plant some stuff on somebody. I don't care. Like, <laughs> you know, old needle said, we throw her in jail, and make her shit, but then we ain't got to tell to find out who she's getting it from. Catch twenty two. Well, or. I, mean, I don't know because if we go speaking? if we go after no the absolutely business, not no no see if we go after the business then the shady shit's gonna go like down you know i mean that business right now their main thing you know of course we found some stuff there but their main thing is tax evasion like they're gonna hey go seriously dude i'm telling you that absolutely just what grinds my gears like they were like oh yeah i don't put nothing in there like what they yeah. think because Don't they know I need a account, bonus? That's where my money comes from. <laughs> they think because their business account has zero that they don't have to pay like taxes. Yeah, that's, I mean, that is it. I mean, you know, because business is where the taxes come out at. Uh, I mean, all I know is if my cash uh, payment don't get made, somebody's getting bubbled. We could, uh, that, uh that's, that's on me if uh, they're illegally doing tax evasion stuff. They, I mean, the owner really, literally admitted, he's like, yeah, I don't put it in there. He's like, I, I pay the workers and I just keep the rest. He they, like, he admitted that there, when yeah. we were down there. Well, see, I can, I can shut the business down then if they're doing that. Because uh, I'm supposed to have copies of their books and stuff like that, you know. I feel like if we need evidence of them, you know, doing more illegal stuff other than tax evasion, I feel like we need to keep the business open until you know well my thing is if we get it shut down is she going to be like okay i done did what i needed i don't need to talk to the cops anymore you know right that's, that's what, I'm what i'm saying yeah because i feel like the only way she is talking to us again like you said she wants to get back at that business like right. like legit you know yeah but i wish we can get somebody from the business to go against her or you know what i'm saying okay so what what do we have on Nikki so far? Like Ghost is vaping. I'm not vaping. That we can get her for. I have the water bottle. Like, and we got it. like you know proof of that and everything. Oh yeah, it was on her. She got caught for selling. I think we need to go ahead and take her into custody and go from there. I don't know about y'all. I mean that's what I'm saying. It's catch twenty two. Oh you know, yeah, I don't do think. But then we ain't got nobody to get to the people we really blow want. fat clouds. Oh, yeah. Well, if she's here. if she's the money washer, then she we, the that might. Where are they even out. washing money at? Like, do we know any? Right, like, so, yeah. That's. I just got some information from him. Uh, he's going to come from undercover. Larry's going to stay in. Uh, Larry's gotten so deep that Larry said that any any trooper or any marsh that pulls him over, he's going to shoot at them. Uh, he's trying to prove his, you know, loyalty to the cartel. Uh, so he'll he, he'll stay in. I mean, uh, conf- I could write up an immunity agreement, but it can only go so far. You understand that, right? Oh, hey, whatever he does is on him. By the yeah, end of the day, if he tries to shoot a cop, like I'm gonna go I'll out there with right guns now, blazing, we'll, undercover or not. The boy shoot at me, he gonna die. Man. Unless gonna die unless you let him shoot at you, and one of y'all plays dead. I'm not good or, at playing dead. You already know that. Well, yeah. Hey, Needle. Smith, he's still on vacation? Yeah, uh, yeah, he, he's on vacation. It's just about Ohio. So, confirmation, Michael Todd is a runner. He works down at a silver auction. So we Really? Dude, uh, I, I swear we got him. people from every single freaking business in this town. Dirty cops. I mean, golly, like... <laughs> Without, hey, without him, we wouldn't have Hey, what, work, was, the, so what was the okay name of that, that business again? Silver Dollar Auction or something like that. The address is on 8112. I mean... I mean Does he pro- have any other properties? Uh, I would have to look it up. I also got another... Need? Hold on one second. I also got another name to uh, investigate. Michael Humphrey. Who the hell is that? He's actually supposed to be in the cartel. He's not the leader, but he's in it. The last name for Sean is Cornwell. Cornwell. But to be honest, man, if that cop told you everything that, like, he's doing pretty daggone good. Well, some of the information I already had. Oh, okay. But see, what was, what was Cameron, my thing is, 
how much of it is true, you know. A lot of this information. Yeah. Because he don't want to go to what, jail. What would you say that Sean guy's name was? Cornwell. C O R. That Hampshire Wills is a criminal business. I I don't think he is. He might be. And the third person, the third, the third person is Cameron. He runs for him and it gets split 50-50. Well, yeah. Do we know where, like, they're getting the coke and everything? Do they have probably the laboratory? The or, I cartel. mean, like... Uh, the cartel's probably making it. They're probably, they're probably right. picking the leaves and then, you know, doing all the work from there. And then they're probably just the money washers and the, you know, sellers. I do know where the money washers go. He said that she runs at nighttime, right? Yeah. Do we have the anklet bracelet on her? We do not. I feel, but, but she's I feel, already been lying to us. But so I feel like if we did, like she wouldn't be doing it. I don't know. She exactly. might be stupid enough too. I don't know. No, we need to. We need to put the fear, fear of life in her. Uh, I, I do know something. We can't go undercover though. No one knows the DA or has seen the DA. Tell my Mister Love. Yeah, and the way he's dressed, he does not look like a DA. <laughs> he looks like a douchebag. No offense, sir. Hey, they call me Dr. Love, man. Leave me alone. So, Dr. you can Love. send him with some of those cars that they need to wash their money. And then do a sting. Yeah. yeah. Um, yeah Wait, what a minute. What can, is it now? You can just go up there with like a, like a big bag and be like... Uh, Hey, yeah, like, uh, is this the place you wash money? Blah, 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 you know. Uh, hey. Actually, no, you don't want to do that. That ain't going to work. Well, no. Remember, my uh, Twitter tag is money, so I can tweet out saying I got. Well, I need to do something. I, I mine's Ghostbusters, uh, so if you want to, like, if you got a haunting place, I guess I can. Mine's the needle. I'm mainly <laughs> I feel like heroin. they would, like, respond to you before anybody. <laughs> Probably so. <laughs> Oh gosh. Well, I mean, what about this? Uh, what Michael Todd at Silver Auction? Yeah. Uh, what about the owner? Do we know the owner? We got an owner name. We can ask him questions. Uh, I can look it up real quick. We can do that. I'll call him and be like, "Hey, any way I can let we meet up or something like that?" Just ask him about See, it. And be like, "Hey, this is off the record." You know. That kind of makes me curious if the owner of that business is involved. What do you get charged with? All right, so Michael Todd actually just had a charge a couple days ago for speeding. Yeah, he, there's no fine or anything in here. All right, what about uh, who's the owner of so Silver the Auction? Is Nate H. Do we have the phone number for Nate H? Uh, let me take a look. No, I don't have a phone number, but I mean we can always use that Twitter. They've been dumb. They've been dumb this far, this 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 long. Well, I mean they don't. I want to be like uh, like because uh, the owner of Silver Auctions called me. Or I mean, what do you think? Yeah, I got some vehicles I want to sell. I just put. I'd ask if it's open or something like that. And yeah, see if say I got you. some vehicles. Yep, see if it's open. Tell you you got some vehicles you want to sell and do that. We need to go pick up an old beater and take it down there and act like we're trying to sell it. Yeah, we can do that too. Yeah, let's go get a beater. Get I'm trying to figure out how I word this because I don't want to put my number out there. You know what I'm saying? Have them respond on, on Twitter. Okay. Tell, tell him to give, your, your, give his number to you because he always... I'm pretty sure he gives it out to buy stuff. Get off our table. I tell you what, eat some comfortable chairs that they'd move out the damn way. Do that. Hey, didn't nobody tell you to uh, go in between chairs? I just asked about some cars. Well, do we need to talk to Nikki? I got her phone number. See if in the city or not. Yeah, we could try her. Again. God, dang it. Hey, 
taking off the table, man. That's gotta get hey, this is my side. Actually, come to find out, Nikki's married, so we can also talk to her husband. It's a family it's a thing. Feller. No, it's busy. Watch the husband be in the cartel or something. Who's something the husband? Around. So his, his name is David. David H. What's H like for? The for their house. Who the hell is pulling up? Probably I don't DEA. Know. We got DEA and uh, FBI. It's supposed to be in today. To yeah, yeah, like, this is like everywhere. <laughs> so we got it's DA, we got DEA, we got FBI, we got marshals, we got troopers. Like, oh yeah, somebody's rock and roll. Oh, I don't think that's. Be. Yeah, that's what you said. I think they were supposed. To, did you say you was having a meeting with troopers or what's going on? If I, I, I mean. I got DEA fella, do you want him in here or no? He says his uh, name was Nate. You can actually go over to Troop Build and start working. Profile. We don't need to go over there and situate the situation. Oh, yeah, that's the meeting I need to have with them in 17 minutes telling them that the, the DEA's coming in. Profiles, I don't even know how, okay. Uh, well, I mean, we got Bart Do we have, we do we have a Nate? So they want to get on Yep, let's do it. Zero conditions. Yeah, I know what y'all Got a phone here. number. Bam. I think we're on channel hey, three. Hey, I got a... We on train three? Yeah. Hey, I got a phone number for at NAH. I just looked it up on the uh, MDT. Oh, sweet. I don't know. Do you want them to change or stay like that? Or does it matter? I mean, me and like Needle that. can run down there and talk yeah. to them. Yep, we're on three. Mike check. I'm gonna to try to call this guy. Mike check. I hear you. Hey, this is the needle. Here you go, guys. Thank you. Put it up. All right. Have a good uh, Jerry. Hey, how you doing? Ah, uh, doing. I hear you. Very good. All right, go ahead. <clears throat> All right, I got this number. Hey, you want to drive? Uh, yeah, I can. Where are we going to the auction place? Uh, well, I'm gonna to try to get a hold of him. Hopefully I can get a hold of him. If not, we'll get a hold of somebody. Yeah, for real. All right, now I don't know if I can cap paste this get here. Old needle. Oh, there it is. <sighs> Tag on it. Ah, that number is busy. Son of a gun. Um, let's just go down uh, there and see if anybody's there. Okay, go ahead and mark it. Um, where's Silver Dollar Auction? Anybody got a uh, postal postal for the silver dollar auction? So punch him and say, uh, <laughs> I'm "Like I'm sorry, I punched you in the face and everything." Well, everything's pretty good. Now, I like this. Hopefully, this leads into, like, cartel. But if there's other people doing legal stuff, if one person gets busted, they're going to try to spread out to everybody. So, I think this is pretty good. It seems like in the last couple of days and everything, you know, they've, they've got a lot of information and everything. Um, did they ever say what the postal was? Uh, no, I don't believe. All right. Well, they say we got it was a Michael Todd, right? Uh, yeah, I believe so. Okay. All right, so we got a Michael Todd. All right, so. Hmm. What's up, crazy? What's up, air? There's some SP. 
So, I mean, I don't know, like... I don't know. It, it seems like there's a lot of stuff going down, but I feel like if we take one person down, then everybody else is going to, like, kind of just, like, go off radar, you know? Right. It kind of so either needs to happen all so at once, right or... What's up, Jimmy Dean? What is, how was your day? Goes? My day was know. great. Um, just chilled with the kids and everything. We made, like, forts and everything. How about we make a trip to Mirror Park? Yeah, I was going there anyway for fuel. Yeah. I'm sorry, I keep saying, yeah, I, I look at your first error, so yeah. Uh, Disney. <laughs> yeah, I feel like people are just going to clam up if we do get, uh, you know, get somebody or something like that, you know? What is that over there? Was that a cop car? Where at? Uh, over... I don't know. That right there. Oh, I see. I don't know, but they are hauling <laughs> it. They really are hauling it. They're still sitting there. Well, there you go. Don't want to burn out going sideways. Oh man, like I would have turned around like, don't you ever <laughs> do a dirt oh, burn out my it. town. <laughs> Listen, old needle got to keep a low profile down here in the city. Oh yeah, with the truck that has lights all over it. Hey, we might be impersonators. Yeah, if we try to arrest them, it's got to be all at once, but there's no way we're going to get them all together. Unless we get somebody to actually call a meeting and be like, hey, and then like we roll up. But I'm telling you. Oops. I need to get out. Going up the tank. Hey, I'm telling you. You know how they were saying, oh, you know, like if we need to, you know, hold hold somebody or something. Bro, tell me I won't stash something on them. You know, I'm like, oh, what's this? A little bit of Columbia, bam, bam. And don't forget, Dirt Slinger 53 YT is live right now on uh, Twitch, and so is Joker. Let's see if I can call that number again. March and the Marshall uh, Gray Direct. Good. Go ahead. Well, you Go want the old or new? Old school. We won't even have to come over here. Uh, DA is going to go ahead and give the two troopers that's here the information. 10-4. They hey, should be used to saying the specific one, by the They way. should be like, yeah, old ass or new? You know, I'm like <laughs> new, I'm like hot and cool, and he's like old and busted. Yeah. Um, yeah, be advised. Um, I tried to call, and um, he is out of town, but we just going to ride down there anyway, but we need, a, we need to get a postal. The shop is at 8112. 8112, gotcha. Did you not hear that, 8112? We need well, something on this truck because this thing's slow. 8112. Eight one one I had to RP because like, this character's never been. What the crap was that? Hey, look back on that uh, 911 call. What am I looking at? I don't know. I was seeing what David H. Wait. A uh, question, David H. Would that be Hayes? If that's Hayes, like legit, he just did not want to call. Ten four. Uh, if it is, then be advised, he just did not want to call. And said, "Please help me." Really, that was him. Hit it. The location. Well, either uh, way. We are on the way. It's on uh, the uh, MDT. Be the first one. To put his phone number, but we're en route to it. I love that sound. The marker's right on the on the GPS. Did I give a postal? 
Uh, it's going to be at, uh, looks at pill, pillbox, the lower level. Or, yeah. You know what? If he's down, or if he's in trouble, I'm, I'm going to ask him if he's married or something. Like, is there anybody we can call? Do you have a wife or somebody? Yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. Dude, I love this sound pack. Bro, I love these sirens, man. Be advised, we're on tape. <laughs> Golly! Oh, dude, I'm swinging it. I didn't even put my seatbelt on. Hey, can you hear me? Yeah, I was trying to get to the hospital, but mm. I didn't make it. A local okay. Hit me. Oh, local hit you? All right, we're going to yes. try to get you out of the car. You might want to step back. Can I get a uh, plate ran real quick? Yeah, let me pull over. All right, can you hear me, buddy? Yeah, I can hear you. <clears throat> All right, uh, where was you struck at? Do what? Where Was you struck by a local? Yeah, my left ankle. Good. All right, so you got you. Okay, Six, all right. Tom. Three, all right, well, zero, we're going to go ahead and try to move you in the hospital, Kilo, all right? Two, Larry. Oh, thank you. <coughs> all right, what's your name, buddy? David Hayes. Okay, Black Mr. Hayes. Team, all right, let's go ahead and we're uh, going to try to get you up, right? Not anybody we're looking for. All right, we'll, we'll get him in three. Ten. Okay, I'm just going to grab him. All right, you might want to step back. Okay, yeah. All right. All right, here we're gonna we're gonna carry you in. All right. Yeah, let's just. All right, thank you. <coughs> you all right. Bit. Um, do you have anybody we can call? Do you have any family members or anything? No, I'm by myself in the city. <coughs> oh, okay. Spouse or anything? Okay. Let's see. Is this? Oh, you know what? You know what? We might have to actually go up, up top. Great. Uh, all right, listen. I'm gonna I'm gonna pick you up and throw you on my shoulder because we got to go up top. All right. All right. All right, officer. Can you meet us up top? Yes, I can. All right. Thank you. All right. Hold on. All right. I know you. It probably looks like I'm strong because I'm a freaking beast. Stronger than me. <laughs> all right, all right. So what? Uh, well, what happened now? You, you said you, you what? One hit you, run you over or something? Well, I was at my house and I went to get him go into my house and I guess what the address for that nine one one or something? And I didn't mean to, and they just knocked me. Maybe and I was to make it back to the hospital, but I didn't make it. <laughs> up or down? Gotcha. Uh, it's going to be the uh, uh, upper. Okay. Well, uh, we see another one call. And luckily, we was near and stuff. So, uh, you say your name's David Hayes? Yes, sir. All right. I just want to. I just want to make sure you know you're good and everything. We don't want you to get hurt. Oh yeah. <laughs> are you sure you ain't got nobody I can call or anything like that? Um, are you married or anything? I mean, we or girlfriend or you know. I do got brother? a wife, but I don't think she's in the city. <laughs> Okay, I mean we can okay we can check or whatever, but that's fine. Uh oh, all right, let's go ahead and get you in here, all right, buddy? All right. <laughs> yeah, I tell you what, when somebody gets hurt, we all show up, you know. Oh yeah. I want to go ahead and lay you down right now, all right? And you just uh, talk to this notebook. All right. All right, there you go, buddy. Thank you. Oh, uh, no problem. Look at all these little fish. Hey, officer, can I talk to you out here? Yep. I'm back here in the room. All right, Tabor. Hey, be advised, uh, this say he had a spouse or anything. I was trying to get the, the name, but he advised that she probably wasn't in the city or anything. Uh, but I do have an officer here. I'm gonna get him to talk to him a little more. Uh, I'll get him taken back down to this car. Hey, uh, we got a, a a gentleman there. Apparently, he got his like butt whipped or something by like a local. 
Okay. Uh, yeah, and he, um, do me a favor. Whenever he comes out and everything, uh, tell him, like, maybe you can call his wife or something like that and try to get the name of his wife for me. All right. Yeah, I yeah there's my number. Him. So, um, and just call me or whatever, right? Oh, I can do that for you. Oh, here right. it comes now. Okay, well, we're going to head roll out. We're going to head roll out. All right. Hey, this officer, this trooper over here is going to take you down to your car, all right? All right, thank you. Yeah, because so your, your ankle is probably a little bit weak, all right? Yeah. All right. Hey, like watch out roll. for them locals, man. They'll beat you up. Oh, yeah. No, no joke. I didn't mean to hit the dude. See Marshal Needle and B Gray back tonight. Alright, sir. Wait, so he got beat up by uh, a local? Okay, I'm supposed to see if get a yeah. wife or something. You, you already talked to him? Uh, that officer is. Um, he's gonna see if he can get a hold of his wife or somebody. Painful. Alright, hold on. Alright, let's roll. Now be advised, um, I was, uh, I got a trooper there asking, you know, if he could call his wife or, you know, or somebody like that. He's going to try to get his wife's name for me and let me know. But he did say he has, he has a wife, so I'm pretty sure that's their guy. Oh, when you go to the auction house. Um, uh, I got to put that back in there. Jordan, uh, did they ever give us there a There we go, yeah, on? I got it. Okay. There we go. I right, be advised we are back to in route to the auction house. <clears throat> I want to try to call him again. Dang, that gone it. I believe all these lights are red. Oh really? They look, they look, I was saying, look green to me, man. I mean, I feel, are we, are we like a, a hero of the day saving the guy's life, you know? I mean, you know. I mean, I think so. I, I, I like to think I am, you know. It's not like we're trying to take him down. <laughs> What'd you tonight? miss? Uh, well, we're doing some inv uh, investigation, and we got FBI, DA, DEA, marshals, troopers, civilian. <laughs> it's like everything's going on. Which is absolutely lovely. Like, this is awesome. I love it. And just let y'all know that apps are applic uh, whitelist applications are open to the server. They're open, and it's even easier to get in and faster. You just got to fill them out thorough. That's the number one thing. Remember, when you're going into the RP server, that you need to remember it is RP. You know, create backstories, you know, your character's life, all that stuff really matters. I just slammed my thumb into the disc. Man, I just slammed my thumb into your dash. It hurt. <laughs> Dang. Yeah, I know. Hey, watch. What's up, Ethan? Oh, that looks boring to me. Thanks, sir. Yeah. Oh, we got lights for it. Oh, yeah. Get out the way, mother... <laughs> Wee! <laughs> Remember, we are in the law. <laughs> yeah. No one's above the law except for us. Exactly. I don't even know if anybody's here. I don't know. If nobody's here, I mean, to be honest, we'll get we'll get a hold of. Uh... Oh, was that somebody leaving? I don't know. Pretty sure that's the local. Ah, it never fails. Now I'm not seeing anybody in there. Let's circle around, and pull in the parking lot. 
Marshal Gray to Marshal Chan, direct. He's on the line. All right. Well, hey, Uncle, we down here. There ain't nobody here. Um, I tried to get in hold of the owner, and I can't get a hold of them or anything like that. What do you want to do now? You know what kind of vehicles you drive? Because I just had two vehicles pass me heading towards that direction. One was a Camaro, and one was a old, uh, like a Cadillac. I had negative. I don't even know the guy or anything like that. Um, we did see a blue ca Cadillac up toward uh, Casino. Well, there's a new place in town over at 9038. You want to go check it out? 9038. All right, we're on our way. What the heck? What is it? Uh, well, you know what it is? Uh, I really yes, this don't will know. be on YouTube. 9038. Where's 90? 90. 938. Right there. Great, Marshall Jen. Uh, you know who owns this new place over here at 9038? Dang, going it like I was hoping we'd get a hold of him. What's that uh, address? Ninety thirty-eight on the building says Benny. Record show Nate H also owns that. Let's hit it. We are in or out, probably about two clicks away. Also have records for Michael Todd owning seven two nine nine. I'll head to that one. Ten four. I'll head that way too. All right, there. I'm telling you, like everybody down here, be getting this money. They be owning everything. Oh, I that's know. that's why they can afford to like pay the cops like a hundred thousand dollars when they get pulled over. Oh, yeah, let me give me 200k on my ticket. You know, I don't want to look bad on record. Where the heck is Pretty this? Pretty sure. Uh, it turn way. left, right, or out? I don't know. Yeah, turn right here. Do you have an info on the cartel? Yeah, we do have some info on the cartel and everything. We got names of people who basically uh, run for them and everything. All right, let's see. Be advised, we're on scene, but we're not seen by here. Doors appear to be locked. Hey, anybody in here? Hey. Probably hiding inside. They got doorbell. Uh, I don't know. Right. See if you can find a doorbell. Like, is it going on out here too? Uh, we we yeah, know on scene, uh, we know a couple. We know a couple of the runners and everything. Be advised, uh, need to come out here, out back. It's out here. We know the runners, and we know like who might be selling uh, and everything. It's not written stone. I rang the doorbell, but nobody's. <sighs> Tag on it. Well. About to start smashing in doors. Telling you, we need a battery ram. I wonder if that officer got that information. He was supposed to, he was supposed to call me. No, I'm not like it's probably like his freaking cousin or like. Or somebody that paid off. <laughs> best friend. He's like, yeah. He's like, hey man, give him like $5 to tell him a different, or like $5 million. <laughs> Alright, no, old man Gray, how did you get up there? You're too old for that. I got my legs. Oh, that's him. Ring, ring. Gray. 
Yeah, I got that name for you. It's a Nikki Campbell. All right. He say anything, All right. Else? Say anything else? He gave me her phone number if needed. Okay. Uh, nah, I don't need the phone number. All right. Hey, I do appreciate, right. it. I appreciate it. Thank you. Yep. All right. Have a good one. You too. Anybody That's good? confirmed. That's her husband. All right. Yep. Uh, Marshall uh, Gray to Woo! Chin or America, Old Gray. Go ahead. Be advised, we just had a uh, we just had the officer uh, confirm that is her husband. So David H is David Hayes. Do we want to see if we can get any information regarding the cartel from him? I highly doubt she's running all these drugs, and he has no clue about it. I mean, can we, I mean, do we have the, the DA we can try to get a subpoena to see how much, like, the bank record for him? Because if he's broke, then, I mean. Now, but we should have enough info to get a search warrant for their house and so he can let us in. Yeah, but we can also get it for the, for the documentation for the what bank account. What the heck account. is that? You see that over there? Oh, We're going to run court. by the courthouse see if we can't get a warrant. All right, we'll, be, we'll see you there. All right, courthouse. Hey, we don't. They say courthouse. Yeah, I get to courthouse. We're on the way to the uh, DA to get a, a little marker there. A, uh, a warrant. Everybody says hello. Hello. Hey, Ghost. When are you going to put your digital truck in GTA? Um, I don't know. I got it done. I just ain't never put it in there. Uh, why can't you see the people on the radio? I got the radio list down. Um, it's only uh, everybody's saying that to you. It's only just the marshals on this channel. The the officers are on the other. I think channel one, which is like the main channel. What's that? Hey, I think a burnout. Hey, ask me if it does a burnout. Hey, that thing do a burnout or what? Is it? Mommy's power is out. Okay, Your mom's power always goes out in there. Everybody says hi. Speedy says hi. Hello. Bobby says hi. Josh says hi. Oh, Jimmy Dean says hi. What a douchebag. Uh, what is it? Bailey the, says hi. The courthouse? No, you don't know where the courthouse is. I yeah, don't. late. Like, literally, it's already, it's already marked. Listen, I'm the driver. There you go. You're the right. Well, let's hurry up. I want to get there. I want to hear what's going on. Golly. You drive slower than, like, molasses. molasses. You want to see slow? Buddy, yeah. No, don't put your lights on because if we're trying to do... I'm just kidding. <laughs> do whatever you want. <laughs> yeah, Diesel said it was... I guess uh, they're in Princess that it was raining and storming there. I was like, it ain't here yet, but it probably will be. Oh, probably coming I swear, like, a TN Gamer said, hi, Katie. Uh, I swear, like, your mom's power goes off if it, it really just... Does. If somebody turns a water hose on too hard, like, the power goes off in that area. Well, they live in, like, nowhere. They do. Uh, they live in a valley. They don't even have six... They live in a hole of a valley. <laughs> <laughs> do you think it's popcorn? I smell it. I didn't. I didn't know we had any left. It's probably my mom. She, like, burns popcorn. I'm so <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, we we gotta see what's going on here. All right, I love so you. Going. All right, wish me luck. We're we're trying to like, you know, yep. do stuff. What is the door? What wrong with this car door? Something's wrong with your door. Hey, what's up? Something's wrong with your door. Don't like the like. Uh, man, the door in here is real bad. Eh, I guess there's a start here. I don't know. Oh, oh man. You call an old man there, youngin. You know who I'm talking to. Don't forget, you're his friend, not mine. Shut up. Listen, you smell. You literally smell like Ben Gay and Old Spice. There ain't nothing wrong so with Old Spice. I had, Spice. A, I had a crazy idea before. Before we go in there, what if they're hiding because they know we're around or that that we're available? What if we clocked out and kept going? To be honest, I'd ra I rather be do, clocked out so I don't get any double wood calls. <laughs> well, not just that. If we, if there is a dirty trooper, they won't know that we're available. Well, you can do it. You can automatically do it. It's on the MTD right now. We yeah. need another channel to go to, though. Uh, I don't know. Needle, what's your favorite number? 
69. Okay, Everybody right. and their mama does that. Come on. <laughs> Everybody. They like they like uh, it goes up to five hundred. They like uh, three seventy nine. Right, Sounds good. As soon as we get on this channel, we hear somebody. Hey, where you at, Billy? <laughs> this is big needle, mic check. This is a uh, young hot gray mic check. All right, Sorry, you're right. Out. Can you say that again? It's Can you hear me? Real bad here since five. I, I thought today was supposed to be pretty, but then it's right. supposed to be. It, it rained like as soon as I walked down the porch, it started raining this morning. I'm like, that's my luck. All right, I clocked. I toggled duty on everybody, so uh, no one should be showing uh, ten eight right now. We might have to actually go up, up to our building. You might do it for yourself because mine was still showing, but when I talked with myself, it knocked me to show me off. Yeah, that's what I did. I hate to tell y'all, but I'm pretty sure it shows what radio channel we're on. <laughs> yeah, if we're if we're clocked in. Oh, I see it for y'all. Yeah, we just need old man Gray to. Listen, what you have to do is you have to I, take out your tablet and then you have I to... I done did. God okay. Dang it. Well, I'm just letting you know. Don't don't get all mad. You know how that makes your hemorrhoids act up. I mean, we can also do a, a Bluetooth call. <laughs> you are you the want. cause of my hemorrhoids. I ain't the, I'm not the cause well, of your hemorrhoids. It's this job. You know, take care of that. Some fishing straw. I just want my money so I can go get my camper and not listen to <laughs> you. All right, let's go get this. Uh, I ain't got a choice tomorrow. but to listen to him. He's family. You, you're a little bit better than Smith, but you're starting to get. <laughs> he sees a little. I don't know. I don't, I don't know, know if he's better as Smith or not. Cause Smith, you know, he fell down the hill and made you laugh. Now that was pretty daggone fun. Yeah, but he wears Hawaiian yeah, shirts. Yeah, Diesel. Uh, and, uh, he hasn't been like, doing anything here yeah, till he now. But I can't, like, in my office, time. like, <laughs> I've got, like, well, really thick curtains and, you know, headset on, so I, like, literally hear nothing when it's doing it, unless it shakes like the house. Too, so. What? What do you do? His own handle? He gave his own name. I have he a grandpa needle. Thank you. He went and had his name legally changed in needle. Just so uh, you walk around and say, I'm in the middle needle. of an exam. Oh, yeah. Echo. There is an echo in here. Hello. <laughs> Come on now. You older than that. Dad, kill me. Very well, Mazelka. I'm sure you will be in the right part. Hello. Who are you over there texting? He said he's doing Woo! God dang oh, it. Come on. Good. Hey, look at that buddy. echo, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so. Oh, man. Think? Why you look so serious? Hell, he just farted. Why don't you go ahead and let one out, too, so you don't look so serious? It is 9.15 here. Hello, Tim. <laughs> hey, you, Tim. And he's probably telling you to get out of his face. Uh, you make appointments there, man. It's the mayor's like appointment. You don't like anything with this guy? Like he's <gasps> oh, I don't want to hit him. Probably hey, it's the city it's hall guy. Days. Hey, what's up, buddy? Hey, you, like you need to put some uh, shoes on, buddy. He got shoes on. Does he? I mean, are you on something? <laughs> They might have SpongeBob might have invisible no. sprayed them. <laughs> That's what it is. Where's he sitting at? I like you his little name. hat. How many chins you got? There's look one right again. there. Look, look, come look up again. Hey, buddy. You uh. All right. Well, you ready to talk to us? Yeah. What's up? All right, we need two warrants. We need an electrical warrant for bank account for David Hayes and his wife, and then we need a warrant to search their house. All right. 
Terminator right now. It's for an investigation regarding the cartel. How uh, fast can you get it, get one? Yeah. Well, I mean, a judge, you know. Uh, I mean, give me like five minutes. I can see what I do. All right. Yeah, so start that five minute timer oh, right man. now. Let's I thought this it. was going to be snail, snail mail. We're almost outside. Yeah, it smells like butt here. <laughs> That's old needle. Anybody get a cigarette? I did not. No, he made he made me quit. Well, I know who drives that caddy. Who's that? Ashton Basham. Ashton Basham. Is he anybody important? No, but he was the one. He, he like did like a little bit like burnout. Don't blow that smoke this way. <laughs> Who's that? Who's that in the Tahoe? There's some in the Tahoe. I didn't see yeah. the Tahoe. There's a white yeah. one down there. No, it's over here to light. I'm probably like somebody probably passing a by. Regular human being. <laughs> yeah, it's like. <laughs> Wait a minute! I have I have eyes. Like, hang on. Oh, good lord! <laughs> All right, I'm not seeing anybody. He must have kept going. You don't have binoculars. I don't. Are you not prepared? I ha I have binoculars, all right? They're going to come by and see, like, two marshals, like, on the ground, like, rolling around. Yeah, I don't think we're supposed to be standing on the ground. Man, they can, like, get off he's the ground. Gonna have, he's going to have him email him the paperwork. Let's go up to the office and clog out. Okay. You know, when we bust in there to, with the warrant, like in my head you know on like fast and furious again like when they you know you come in my house disrespect my family oh my goodness i'm just saying like I, this is my second one second fast and furious like thing today you know i'm just saying Good marking myself because I know you wouldn't. Yeah, I know you know well because you you got like do you tell me you don't know how to get to that gone a sandy short from here? Listen, I do, but I like to have a reference. Like all you gotta do yeah, is I don't go straight. Hey, listen here, y'all, bastard. Sorry, is the two Chevys trying to race each other? Negative, that was nails. <laughs> yeah, Hector is. Hey, I, listen, I do want to tell you That's some information nobody knows, all right? Okay. Like, they don't, like, the other two don't know. But, um, you know, since we've been talking to garages and stuff. Yeah. I heard that Hector's running those spoon engines. Really? I have. Huh. What if, what if my uncle hey. would get it? <laughs> I don't know. Hey, hey, old, bu gray. old, old and busted gray. Yeah. I got some info from my officer. I just want to pass it on to you, all right? Well, yeah, what do you got? Well, we got intel that old Hector is going to be running spoon engines. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't shut the hell up. <laughs> so we didn't keep that Look. in mind. <laughs> oh, great. Where's that fella that had them there microphones so we can yell at people? Oh, I don't know. I ain't got a microphone, but I, I definitely want one. I'm sorry. You said you want. We what? need to find them. You want a what? Yeah, I want one. Look, look, look. Oh, oh, chain back. Or what? What? Uh, chin back there got yeah, him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We sure do. Were you about to say Wang? <laughs> I started to actually say wag actually I'm like, oh. <laughs> I knew you were going like, I'm to. so sorry. Hey that was a red light.
It was yellow. Oh, uh, that was maroon. <laughs> oh, so apparently we're going to be doing a uh, we're, we're going to be doing a uh, a raid or a whatever a warrant search warrant whatever. I like, say, watch yourself. Be advised, don't y'all break down. We only have all Chevys here. My Dodge is up there at the uh, uh, office. Go ahead and drop him off, Needle. Be advised, he probably has a, a secret mechanic working on it right now. <laughs> probably pulling the transmission. That's how I knew about the spoon engines. <laughs> Are you putting one in as your Dodge? he's riding in your pickup, not his. Yeah, but you know what? His GPS must not work because I have to keep telling the girl I have to ride. No, you just don't know how to mark yourself. <laughs> uh, listen, like, whatever. You need to get some uh, work on these daggum traffic lights. Take record. three years. Jeez. I need a for the house. We need some uh, manual controls. Here's my manual control. As it turns green. <laughs> I usually don't That's turn my light on for goes. green lights, but it's okay. Maybe <laughs> that way. Oh! Dad, it, it's a stop sign. <laughs> my bad, I thought it was oh, a yield. Snap. Oh wow! Where'd you get that? Luckily, you got that red bar. Yeah, not so lucky for him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I love how like we're supposed to be like it's you know cognito, but he's driving an SUV as Marshall on the side that says <laughs> Marshall. <laughs> he's there. He's there. Uh, you know, catch that. Yeah, somebody need to go get that C eight. Somebody needs to help get that old. Uh, Tahoe faster. What's this fan up here doing? <laughs> <What>? <laughs> we're out here fighting crime, but we're breaking speed limits while at it. You know, we we we, just, we, we gotta do our thing. Need some nitrous in this thing. They you were this saying. <laughs> I can't say anything. My ram ain't much faster. <laughs> hey, it looks like they got a dent in the back bumper of that Tahoe there. <laughs> yeah, from some Nimrod that can't drive. I don't know, Matthew. Up. I don't know if that Dodge is faster than a C8. That sucks. Looks better though. <laughs> I'm gonna get up here like my truck's gonna be like, for you guys to like tore apart. <laughs> yeah, probably so. Oh, don't worry. Needle's got a uh, taser cartridge with Is his it name there? on it. Is my truck even there? I don't. I hope, my truck don't look like it's in a parking lot. Well, I mean, there is a brick wall there. Yeah, but oh, hey, hey, Chin, you all right? <laughs> I guess that's why you don't drive a, <laughs> a Corvette in the desert. I mean, should we check on them? <laughs> I, I we probably should, to be honest. I don't think your truck's here, to be honest. I don't think it is either. Like, it was here, wasn't it? What's the dang troopers, like, done it, pounded it or something? Probably so. We should probably go over there and help him, but... Oh, gosh. Like, the whole entire police force is coming. My truck was here. <laughs> Where's he at? Is he in the car? He's not. He must have got flung out the window. Chid, where are you, Chid? 
He's over here. Here, my little chitty chit chin. Go on, don't tell my son that. <laughs> Wait, Look at uh, my Tahoe. Oh, he said, go on, Lee. Like, how do you get over in there? Good grief. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Just remember, seatbelt save lives. For a good mile, didn't you? Yeah, I wasn't wearing my seatbelt. What it looks like. Hey, I want to know what the heck happened to my daggone truck. I think I can get it transferred back here. It might have poofed. <clears throat> Take out. Okay, yeah, I can get it back. Okay, there we go. Cost me seven hundred and some bucks, but I got it. Oh gosh. Hey be advised, ain't that the Tahoe that you seen? Uh, yeah, that's it. If it is, it is messed up. Be advised, Uncle, that is a police uh car. I don't know what happened. I think I've got more taser charges. I want to keep this going. Lock that up. All right, we got a status on that warrant. <clears throat> Why you turn around while I'm trying to follow you? It's awkward. Well, I mean, I thought you were trying to tell me something. <laughs> no. Try to get that got it like this owner of Silver right, Auction. There was it first. Listen, I got a nine bullet with your name on it too. No, you don't. You ain't that dumb. Which one of y'all wants it first? Uh, Bob does. Dad gummit. Hey, listen, I'm not the one you know that wrecked my car. You kind of did break check me. <laughs> Wow, you could just blame him like Even that. A stop sign, you know. All right, so oh no! Hey, well that's under. I can jump what? around it. I'm jumping. You ain't slick. Slick? What are you talking about? Oh, These we, you put we down see here. it right there. Hey, oh, good group, double trouble. It is. Oh god, it's like right under, it's under my you can't truck. Drive around that one. I'm back in. So I forgot to read the manual on how to pick it up. He, I, I think oh, you, you use your third eye. Yeah. yeah. I'm pretty sure they're one hit wonders, so you ain't spiking nobody. All right, so, um... One and done? That ain't no good. Well, I, I think it's hard to, like, push it back up and put it in your pocket, you know? Yeah, you have, to have a, you have to get your raveling game up. <laughs> what do you call me? Hey, that fella over there said needles was wuss. Hey, who's that? Who's that in the unmarked Tahoe? So what is F D A? What are they doing? Yeah. Guess getting troopers in order. Uh, All right. Uh, they need to do better. Let's get in here and clog out and then tell. Okay. Oh yeah, we came all the way up here for that, didn't we? <clears throat> we <With> douchebag. <laughs> douchebag. You want to hurry up? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't think I was clocked in. I better get my I don't think I, well, I, I don't. Okay, I'm off now. Now, if you're off, will you still see the blips? That on your GPS? Me. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> but you won't get any, any uh, alerts. Oh, good. Right, we didn't so, do that uh, anyway. I sent a random text message to the Sean guy. 
to see if he re responds. Uh, he did. He said uh, he was busy from the text message. I asked him if he was available because uh, I got some laundry. And we're just waiting for that reply. Hey, Nito, I just want to let you know this doesn't mean like dry, drying clothes, okay? Okay. <laughs> so what's it might? I'm just kidding. I know it means wash your mud. <laughs> Look. What's that thing you, you taught me, nephew? What are those? <clears throat> Got the flames, bro. He drew those on with the marker, too. Hey, they look like it. Up. I did it on the clock, too. While well, sitting at the director's desk. Oh. Yes, yes, yes. yes. You gonna, chin gonna kick your chin. <laughs> Oh, oh well, my gosh. She ain't gonna find out about it. What have you missed? Um, well, we're waiting to get a warrant to go others, search a place. There, but... Now, are we getting. What are we getting? Are we getting. We're getting a warrant to search the place. Are we getting the bank records? Yes, bank records and also to search their house. And then he's got a lead on washing laundry or something. Gotcha, gotcha. Now, where do they. Where do they live? I have no idea on that one. He didn't get an address for him. Call it, call it, do you got that trooper's number? I got an address. It's uh, in Mirror Park. One second. Seven three two zero or seven three one nine. It was. They you said already it's got a two story house. That's what uh, Nick uh, Nick Low or whatever area. Yeah, yeah. They said it's a two-story house right across from the stop sign. You already got the paperwork? Nope, waiting on it. Well, I mean, we can always go down there and... Are we raiding ready? or are we searching? Well, you guys can start the raid, <laughs> and I can get, I can at least get with the subpoena, kid, look at their bank information from here. So, I mean, we can basically roll in like, get on the ground, you know, type deal. Yep. Sweet. Oh, heck yeah. I'll give him the needle. Yep. That, don't ever, don't ever say that. That right. probably pickup line correct. never ever probably worked for anybody. God, Hit it one God. time. Listen, Wait, you ain't going to take your, your marked giant Tahoe? Just drive that gummy. <laughs> <laughs> This isn't an actual road. Yeah, but I drive a Dodge. Oh, okay. Be advised, uh, Needle, you might want to check your truck out. That was a little dirt path. Your front end may have come out. Be advised, uh, <laughs> Gray. <clears throat> this is Chevrolet. It can take anything. Except for a dirt road. Hey, what are you behind me for? We're going it to take, the... It can also take an asshole. <laughs> hey, how, how, how fast is that truck going? Uh, you, want, you want me to put the needle on the floor? Why don't you make, put the needle over to the triple digits? We're going to get... <laughs> ain't going to break it. <laughs> you might want to flip your lights on. I need those lights. I don't even see him behind us, is he? Nah, he might break down. <laughs> oh, there he is. He finally caught up. Now, I like Chevys. I, we just messing with them. So, for anybody says he's a hater of Chevrolets, I like Chevys. I like all the vehicles. Where y'all want to post up at? I'd say around the water hole. But is that a gas station or something? The daggum pond, son. Jeez. Well, why don't you say pond and not water and hole? There's a water hole over there left over here. I was confused also. <laughs> I mean, about it's the like, water where, where are we, coming. like, I mean. Come on, I ain't that daggum old. 
Now, question if, uh... Right up here on the right, there's some parking spots. And we can see their house. Especially across the stop sign, ain't it? Now we can't see nothing. Good job. You said it was at the stop sign on Nicholas Place, right? It's over... Hold on, let me go... Seven... What was it? Seven... Was it seven one? Seven... I don't know. I thought it was in front of us. Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh... Hey, did you get that bad wood wood cow? I sure did. Yeah. Hey, uh, what's your don't look like nobody's there. Your, uh, driveway or something? Yeah, I don't know. He's probably like it's sitting on their porch. Like, yeah, is this the house? <laughs> probably so. <laughs> I'm Uncle Bob. <laughs> oh, I mean, uh, I'm Uncle Gray. Was he if was he doing just standing there? I don't know. He's probably got like his Polaroid out. He's sitting there like trying to shake it to see if he, you know. <laughs> Well, we got the guy's number. We got the guy's number. We can always call him like, hey! Make me at your house. Hey, Blake. <laughs> yeah, Blake. I'm a friend of your wife's. Oh, look at him getting high tech. Yeah. Wait, are those mine? I played the fifth. So, um. If you stand here, you can look straight across. There's a for sale sign in front of the house. Right over here. I mean, we don't see, we don't look all suspicious or anything, do Hey, somebody give me some binoculars. <laughs> hey, listen, you need to come for. Hey, is there a for sale sign? Yeah, there's a big old for sale sign. Oh, is it the what? Is it the left one, like on the very end down there? Yeah, it's like right at the end of the road. Right oh, there. I see it. But it don't look like nobody's there. Yeah, well, somebody just parked in a driveway over there, but I, I don't I think that might just be their house. <laughs> the guy was driving like a uh, black and white Charger. Yeah, but, I mean, he should have big man. money. I brought that. What's you going to do? Like, step around a corner? Probably, like, take a dump or something. I don't. Oh God. I don't know. Do we? Have, I wonder if we got an EPA on the daggone uh, warrant or anything. What if that better oil place got a, a, a officer discount? Better oil. Yeah. Oh, it's a dental place. Yeah, what you thought it was? I I thought it was oil. You said at first. I thought it was like vapor or something. Oral. Well, I thought it said oil. Well, I did. He might have went and got his nails did. His nails did? Yep. He probably back there trying to make her hip, trying to get over <laughs> that <dang> old <laughs> thing and say, oh, God, I gotta get over here. How's the family? <laughs> family is doing great. JJI. Um, you should put the rims that you have on the 6 on your RAM. I, I don't even know which ones I have on there. Um, uh, I have to, I have to check. I don't know about the 6 show though. Um, direction, what happened while I was gone? Uh, we're waiting to get a warrant. You gotta search the house. I thought he said oil. I thought he said oil. It sounded like he said oil. Gray, young Gray to, uh, Chandrick. Well, I tell you what, if he's not home, we're still going to search the place and we'll take everything we have. Man, I wish we could find like a load of that, you know, you know, that cash. Yeah, but if we find cash, like, where have y'all been vacation? 
<laughs> they went on they went on a raid and never came back. I'm probably like put my two weeks in then. <laughs> oh, they would crap their shelf over that one. Yeah, probably so. They need the old needle around. And don't uh, don't forget Dirt Slinger fifty three YT is live so you can see, you can see on his side. Even though we're not really doing anything right now. Well, I don't. I didn't get a call from either one of them. I don't know what they're doing. I switched him. So the warrant hasn't come in yet. Um, did get the subpoena for the banks. Their bank account is actually pretty low. So if she is running, she's getting screwed on the money. He was munching on something. For real. He really was. So, what, his bank account's low? No, his bank account, he got 129000 in the bank. She got sixty grand in the bank. What about, I mean, well, we, what about cash? I mean, that's the main, that's the thing. That's he where has, it's all going to be. He has 4000 in cash. Let me take a look at her. You know, if I was on something legal and I didn't want anybody to know, she I, has she has fourteen thousand in cash. If I if I was on something legal and I knew people were you know that they could you know check the records, I'd have a really good friend that would be holding everything I had. Yeah, and I probably feel like that's what she's doing because, I mean, we've already been questioning her, you know. Yeah, because if you're doing like three or four hundred a night, and you're getting a percentage, and you only got what sixty grand in your but bank. On good news, that message I sent to the head of the cartel, he did message back. Let me read these two messages, and I'll let you guys know. Hey, you know, for uh, for her and everything, if I was doing something I wasn't supposed to. And I figured people might be uh, checking into it. I'd have a really good friend that would be holding everything I had. I don't know why, but I kind of want to go down to that Slipknot place. We still got to get your Tahoe fixed. <laughs> I will slap you. Standing next to me on the radio. Anywho, all right. So, all right. Is he up there like eating lunch hey, without us? Got the information. That's what it sounds. Are you eating without us? Yep. <laughs> so I'll need I got, a I got my old got that beat so I gotta eat. As soon as y'all left, that that uh, little delivery service brought the food. I'll save y'all a wing or two or, or one. What a All right, so uh, who wants to go undercover and meet up with the head of our cartel? Needle, the only one who do it. Why is Everybody that? knows our name. Don't all speak at once. Uh, uh, probably I think old, uh, old, old Gray would do it. Old Needle. Needle's the only one that can do it. They all know the Grays. They don't be too. No, they don't. Everybody knows Needle. <laughs> All right, knows needle. needle. Keep the boots on because uh, 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 Marshall wouldn't normally wear those. Go ahead and change your clothes. I'll give you a location to meet up. I'll make sure to put a Hawaiian shirt on. Yeah, tell me your, tell me your name is uh, J. Smith or D. Smith or something like that. Oh, Gary. <laughs> Watch I get there and it'd it be Smith. That's the cartel leader. <laughs> Make sure uh, you... That would uh, be crazy. When you uh, change clothes... You're going to sell under... him a laundry card for $10,000. Repeat that. You're going to sell him a laundry card so he can do his laundry. And it's going to be $10,000. Okay, is somebody going to give me that card? 
I'm gonna have old Greg give it to you. Okay. Whenever you go change clothes, make sure you still got something you can wear for. If we do do a bust, you can bust it out and be like, "Kabam!" I got you. I can. I can bust. It <laughs> I mean, not the needle. I'm talking about like a bag. <laughs> I got you. He go. He go. <laughs> he go. He gonna have a badge like on his like butt cheek or something. Bam! <laughs> boop, boop, five, boom. Hey, who said I wasn't stopping by the tattoo place? <laughs> <laughs> that way, y'all, nobody can take my badge. All right, so uh, we we gotta get you a ride. Oh yeah, state issued. Yeah, you want a ride? I got you one right here. Let me get a let me get an address for you to uh, be this. <laughs> It's a work. <laughs> okay, I guess. I kind of wanted the station wagon over there. <laughs> yeah, we'll get this. We're commandeering this uh, police car or this uh, whatever this car. I feel like I need a mullet to drive this thing. Well, that's why old Gary needs to be here. He got one. <laughs> we probably need to. Uh, <laughs> Tell the cops, you know. Hey, Vice, could somebody go over to Channel 1 and let the cops know that this Stupid uh, vehicle... Stupid that gone car. ...is going to be for state issued. Chin. Chin's doing it. Okay. <laughs> I'll, uh... You go get it or what? Hey, God! First hot wire? <laughs> no, it's not my first one, but it's not one to. Listen, it's. it's... Alright, they're notified. Look, it's even better if the alarm's still going off, because you'll know I'm a criminal. <laughs> like when you pull up? There you yeah. go. <laughs> Alright. Here, here's, a, here, here, here's, your, here's your screwdriver, buddy. Okay. Might want to get closer to the door. Okay. okay. All right. I'll be back. <laughs> Who says police officers ain't crooked? Hang on. You got to get the card. Oh, we we spray paint this thing. They put it like hot rod paint. He put the badge on his prison pocket. Good grief. Y'all got a post on meeting them at? Marsh Gray to Chin. We got a postal? I'm looking now. Hey, you might, like, want to put all your police items in your truck except for your gun. Okay. That way, just in case you try to search it or anything like that, I mean, which they shouldn't, but, I mean, you know... Yeah, that might be smart. We don't want any ties to it. What are you doing out here? A rattle can paint job in the middle of the parking lot? We just stole well, this thing. You. We I just know. stole it. And we parked, well, we went no. from there to there. I mean, the owner probably will come back and not be happy. I, he don't look cool. We got to make him look cool. Four. I'll have to meet you there. There hey, you go. Hey, uh, hey, Needle, give the uh, old and busted gray the keys to your truck. <laughs> I'll do my best to get there. Did you paint your truck a matte black? That was old, uh, what's his face? Oh, I was like, I thought it was blue. No, it was, uh, it was black with like a blue finish, you know, but they ruined it. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna take my mullet machine. All right, did we get a post or yeah, he... but I forgot what it was. You have okay, to ask. ask. <laughs> you wild boy. <laughs> He's gonna die before he gets there.
<laughs> oh my gosh. All right, so. How far back we need to be? I'd say pretty far because uh, Old Needle don't need to get shot today. Get okay, pulling my rat out of my bag. I'm gonna go fill up my truck real fast. Cause I don't wanna be I don't wanna be down here then I have to stupid wide rims. Watch him get pulled over by like uh, the troopers or <laughs> something. Make sure you give us updates. <clears throat> so let me know in chat, like, you think oh, uh, you think oh, Dirt's going to do pretty good? Hey, like he I said, he, he he's live, he so if, if you want to see what's going, what's going on his on. side, because I, don't, I won't know, check out his channel. Because he's going undercover. He's gonna probably wear something stupid too. I guarantee you. He gonna be out there looking like oh, uh, like Miami Vice or Magnum PI with short shorts and a Hawaiian shirt. Knowing him, he gonna put a white suit on. Probably. I had a question today. Okay, so Chin messes like unknown number, messes this cartel guy like the owner or leader, right? Okay. Did he just say, hey, do you want a card or something? I mean, like, who would not find, like, that suspicious, though? Like, how, I'd be I like, how did you get idea. my number? Who, you know, who, you know, that's just, I don't know. I don't either. That's why I wanted to know if he would give us updates so we can watch his tail so they don't ambush him. Yeah, especially because you know they know we're on them. You know they do. And my thing is, like, I don't even know why they're working with, like, Nikki or something, because if she's out here trying to, you know, get that uh, garage shut down, I'd be like, she, she'll she rat on you, you know? Well, that or she's trying to kill the competition. True. Maybe that's her whole thing. Hey, you know what? That's what I was thinking about. A is it, now, that a uh, Raymond, Kramer, Kramer, whatever, Roman? Now, that's the, the son, right? Oh, uh, Cameron. Cameron is a son. Who's who's the dad? Hunter. Hunter. Okay. So now, which one is in the cartel? I don't think either one of them are. I think they were freelance, and that Nikki chick got in touch with the cartel, and now she's trying to get them shut down so they have the full business. Is what it seems like. I mean, wonder if they know anything about her, though. You know what I'm saying? What they like? If we talk to them, they like spill anything about her. But, like, you know what See, she's that's into? What I was wondering. I mean, that's why I said I kind of wanted to go down there because it just seems like there's got to be more to her that somebody else knows. Yeah, I mean, if she's doing all this to get them shut down, they've got to know stuff on her because I mean, like, you know, she's going to talk to people because I mean, if you're bringing in new trucks or you know, cars, everything, buying houses. And, I mean, you're literally, they're making the same money, you know? Mm-hmm. So, I don't know. I don't either, but that's what makes me wonder. Like, I feel like the fellers over there at uh, Slipknot might know a little more than what they're saying. To, but at this point, instead of them covering their own tail, because they're already up shit creek, they need to get after the other ones so they can get a better deal. That's what I'm saying. Like, I mean, if we went and talked to them, like, listen... Like, what do you know about her? Like, y'all know y'all, you know, your company's in jeopardy right now. Like, you know, you know this. We've been down here. You've, you know, you've been raided. You had employees shooting up in the air and everything. I'm like, y'all better give her something. Because, I mean, they're they're going to get in trouble for tax invasion anyways. And, I mean, that's, that's, mm -hmm. that's pretty hardcore. And you know that the DA's going to come down everything he can. Do what? I was like, you know, the Mark DA is going. The DA is going to come down with everything he can on him. 
Yeah. All right, where we need to meet them at? What's my favorite movie? Oh, that's gonna go everywhere. My favorite movie is either Tremors or Maximum Overdrive. Marshall Needle where? to anybody? What? Uh, what was that post again? That's a good question. Chin, where the heck are you? We need a post. <laughs> He's probably right, Matthew, still stomping down one. them chicken wings. <laughs> We're getting flung out of the Corvette. Yeah, probably so. Where are y'all guys at? Uh, Actually, I think you might have had a brain fart. LTD. Which one? Uh, Mirror Park. Ooh, I hear thunder in here. Hopefully we don't lose power. I got a okay, backup. Y'all want, y'all want me to come there bit. or just kind of hang around? Uh, no, what? go to. We need to find you somewhere in the back alley. He said it was like nine something, but I can't remember. Hang on a minute. I got an email. Chance. Let's say uh, you might want to email him or something. Storm just left. Isn't Florida supposed to be getting a big storm or something? I thought. Y'all said that because some like in last stream or something. Because I know Matt K lives in Florida. All right, Josh, you have a good one. If we can just get this bus going on. It doesn't show blips when you're off, off duty. When you're, yeah, when you're off duty, it don't show blips. His main brain went to sleep. He said he's waiting for it to wake up. 10-4. Give me a minute. Dang, they close down dominoes. That postal was 9324. If you want to go around and kind of scope it, I wouldn't really meet until we know if he's coming back or not. Yeah, be advised. Let's know he's there. 9324, you said? Uh, Storm was just at my house, blow tree down. 10 4. Power, the power lines. Oh, that guy. Oh, y'all want me to head over like, there? Like, where we live, we're pretty good. I mean, we're really I lucky about scope it first, not getting case, storms uh, or anything. If he's going to come back because, um, like, the storms, we usually get, like, the sides and stuff of the storm. Um, like, Beckley and, like, down the county, right, they usually four. get the main, like, main storm. And, like, where Cage Mom lives, they get, like, the main storm. Uh, be advised, I'm going to be here on Vinewood right now. What was that postal again? Was it 9320? I think, was it 9320? That's terrible. I can't remember what it was. Ninety-three, ninety-three twenty-four. Got it. Watch it. I'm pretty sure it is a laundromat. What is the business there? What business is that? That's a warehouse. Or be advised, I'm over here on Vivewood right now. Hey there. Y'all there? Copy that? Needles here. 
Yeah, sorry. Checking out my Jippus. So 9324 is the number, and I was looking around it. We could probably get up on one of them hills and kind of scope it out. All right, be advised. Um, I think I'm going to go up uh, near the water, uh, the water hole over here. You know, on the left there. Smart ass. <laughs> All right, I'm running around the corner from that poster you gave me, so I'm just going to kind of scope it out and tell y'all a, a good area y'all can seek yet. I do know if we're going to be doing this, just in case, we'll bring it. Hey. You honk at me again. I only turned one case. shade of green. Oh, what's up, truck kid? How's it going? Glad you got the get. Uh, oh, nah, nah, nah. Glad you got to uh, see the stream and everything. Yeah, be advised. I think I'm gonna go up here. I got my binoculars. Ten four. Now, because uh, I think there's a hill across it over there. It's like, ain't it like a laundromat? I think it's that wood place. Is it the wood place? Wait, is it the wood place? Not a hundred percent, but it looks like the lumber yard. Oh, it is. Oh yeah, never mind. Like, hang on, we're gonna have to back up. Yeah, never mind. It's the wrong place. I'm not gonna go through here because literally, it don't even. What's up, Wayne? How's it going? Diesel, I'm still here just eating. Oh well, heck yeah! I'm out of hot pockets, y'all. I'm out of hot pockets. So I don't even know what I'm gonna be eating. There's something there. What is oh, that? Oh yeah. All right. Ooh. I don't know. Was that? A, I don't know if that's a local what. Ramen noodles. I like ramen noodles. Pizza rolls. Oh yeah. I ain't got pizza rolls either. I ain't got nothing. Katie cooks some like really good like barbecue ribs and stuff. Yeah, I know. Oh, Willie ain't got a Cadillac right now. Yeah, I wasn't. I ain't, I wasn't gonna hot wire one day for him. Um. Let's see. I need to get a spot. Yeah, be. I think I'm gonna turn around right here. Oh, it's a free. Oh yeah, perfect. I keep forgetting the area is here. Oh, you know we gotta do some off roading up in here. Boom, shocker locker. I want to point this up this way, just in case I need to rock and roll. Hit your panic button, tell them you're out of hot pockets. Lord, we'd have the whole police force here. <laughs> oh, I don't want my radar. I ain't worried about that. Sweet belt's on. All right, be advised. I'm over here, uh, parked over here under this bridge over here. Oh, you know what? I need to get my gun out. 10-4, I'm over here up on the hill. That postal is 9324, correct? 10-4. Okay, I don't know what y'all are talking about a wood place for, but uh, that's not what it is. Say it wasn't 100%. I'm watching this and some old diesel sparks making Halloween shine. <laughs> Advice, I tried to put gas in my car about three times and it's I guess it got a leak or something. Be advised you have money? Uh yes. Do you have cash? It does help. Uh yes, I have a lot of it. Oh, man, I need a spot to get more after I like before I spent three tanks. Be a lot better if it was freaking nighttime. Where do you park that? 
Oh, I see you. Be advised, Wait. I see you. I see you up there. I need I need a better hide spot, but there's like no coverage here. I guess we're gonna have to do this building or something. Be advised, that is kind of like a wood. Is it the wood spot or it's the Yala hardwood, right? That's what it looks like. I don't think we're in the same spot. I think you're in the I'm wrong over area. Here. Nine, three, two, four. That's where I'm at. It should be a yellow build. Yeah, you, it should be a yellow build or like a blue building and a yellow building. Don't see the gas station right beside it? Yeah. Okay, that's where I'm at. All right, well, come back this way. Come like you're going back toward the, the bridge over here. And park in the parking lot with the blue uh, with the blue building. I gotta try to get dag on gas first. <laughs> okay, yeah, we're good. Do we have the ETA when they're when they're going to be getting here? Or? Not a clue. Like, how much gas do you have? Yeah, I can't. My truck's right over. Well, it's under here, so I have to run back there just a little bit. But he's up on the mountain up there, just in case. What's that? Who is that? Are you down by the bridge? I am. Okay, well you just scared the crap out of me because like I'm up here in this bush. Did you park your truck under the bridge? Yeah, that reckless driving was behind us, so that's why I moved. Gotcha, gotcha. Do we have do we know what they're driving or I mean when they're coming or what's going on? No, without Chen being around, we don't got a whole lot. Be advised, I still have a hole in my fuel tank. <laughs> I don't know uh, if I need a new car or what. Uh, what? Just... Uh, is it, like, completely out of fuel? No, but it's close. Well, don't worry about it. You ain't gonna be driving 50 miles. Just park it there, and after that, after they leave, you know, just make sure they leave first. And I'm gonna park in between these all these blue buildings over here. No, 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 no. Go back around. Go to the other side of the blue building. There's actually people down there standing. I don't know. Come back out oh, of the parking great. lot. <laughs> Come back out of that parking lot and go I'm on out down. the parking lot. Okay, yeah, keep going straight. I see you. Just keep going straight. It's going to be this left right here. This blue building right there now. Be advised, that's construction workers. 10-4. Alright, yeah. It looks like them. Oh. I don't... I just want to... <laughs> yeah. Alright, I see you. Do you have a white shirt on? I see... <laughs> do you see the flaming boots? <laughs> I do see the flaming boots! I'm gonna take a picture of him on Snapchat. <laughs> Oop, tag on. <clears throat> All right. All right. Have you emailed Tim back to find out what's going on? I haven't got an answer yet. 10-4. Alright, so we are basically chilling here. 
until we find out what's going on. Well, the thing is, even if, even if uh, I move to the backside, I'm over here at that hospital by the fire station. If we're, I got like a clear view and everything. If we, I mean, if we if we can't get in the meters or something, at least we can search the house. Or did we get the warrant? Is the thing. Do one of y'all have a sniper rifle or something? No. I feel like we need it because I'm messing with the head of the cartel here. Well, I have the pistol. It's all right. I'm a, I'm a decent shot. Oh gosh. I got a flashlight on too. All right, I don't know. Um, hopefully we get like confirmation on this and everything. We just need to make sure we just gotta watch for non-local vehicles. <laughs> and if they were real smart, they would drive a you local car. You should car. have a uh, vest uh, somewhere in your bag, if you know what I'm saying. Yeah, I do. Just make sure you do that. Uh, <laughs> he sent me a picture. Of, after you put it on. <laughs> he sent me a picture up here. I guess he's trying to find the bush I was in. Ten points if you hit dirt. If you <laughs> sure that happens. Oh yeah. Before I got it. Well, I got a. I got a. Well, I brought the the rifle. Well, I didn't bring my shotgun because I really wouldn't do anything. But I don't have the scope or anything like that. So. I mean, worst case from there is we just start shooting down there and try not to hit him. Hey, if anything goes south or something, try like you think you can clear that wall. You said, "Can I jump over it?" Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, if anything goes south or something, jump over that wall because I I can't really see what I'm shooting at down there. I'm just gonna start shooting. Yeah, please don't. <laughs> Well, I mean, what? like, if something happens, you'd be like, clear, and then I know just to start letting lead fly. Ten forward. You got your, uh, carbine rifle or whatever? Yeah, uh, I got, I got a rifle. Yeah, just roll with that one. Don't well, shoot I, no pistol over here. <laughs> I mean, I'm going to shoot a rifle, but I ain't got a scope on it or anything. Yeah. I'm just going to just start, like, letting lead fly, you know? I keep looking at them bushes up there trying to find you. Well, I'm glad you can't see me because that's the whole main thing is me, me hiding and them not seeing me. I mean, I blend yeah, in. I'm, clo like I'm close enough, so if you need me, you just holler and I'll come blazing in. Yeah, I mean, I almost need somebody on the other side of this wall, or like, you know, on the other side of the wall. But there go, it. Needle. You want me to come down there and sit in the car with you, too? That'll help. <laughs> Hey, too bad we didn't have old Smith. We'd put him in your truck. <laughs> yeah, I like need to change your shorts before anything even started. Listen, I got this. I'm looking around. I don't. I haven't seen any, you know, suspicious vehicles or anything. I feel like their cartel. They roll up in a Lincoln or like a, a Cadillac. If they roll up in like anything but anything but that, then I feel like they're not really that, you know, making that much money. But it'd be like a new cat, like not one of those like old like rusted out Fleetwoods. <laughs> oh yeah. Well, hopefully we get confirmation about everybody about everything else going on, because right now it's like we're kind of waiting. We can't do anything. Uh, we don't have none to numbers or anything like that. Oh man, I wish we had the number to him, to the cartel. How did he get the number? Unless one of the mothers told him, I ain't got clue. Cool. 
If we look for Sean, how many Sean's are there? We got a Sean James. Sean James. Got a driver's license. Got a Dodge Charger. I feel like. I feel like it. Johnson Boys Fab. Owner. Hey guys, while we're waiting on old Chin, I'm gonna go grab me a snack or, you know, in my glove box, if you know what I mean. 10 4. Alright. Hey, you know a Sean James? Hang on a sec. Alright. Chin is, Chin is partially back. Uh, he said that the guy was there for 30 minutes and left, but now he's on his way back. Okay, I'll just wait out then. Alright, well, do we know what he's driving or anything? Hey, uh, Needle, make sure you get his, like, license plate and everything. If you can't... Chin had to refresh it. Yeah. Chin had to refresh his brain. He said when he gets back, he's going to text him and ask him. Okay. All right, Ch uh, or uh, um, uh, Needle. Make sure you get his license plate number if you can. Take a selfie with him. That way we have a good That's diagram. Sure thing. <laughs> hey, you can use your binoculars and zoom in on the plate. Uh, yeah. May I, if I can, I mean, I can see your boots from here, so I should be able to see it. Can you see me flipping you off? Hang on, let me see. Uh, actually, yeah. Put your hand down. Yep, you just did. You just flipped me back off. Can you see me All up here? All the way off. I don't. I blend in. Uh, where are you at, Uncle? The other side of the hospital. Sitting and waiting. Okay. Hold on, are you in one of the bushes on the side of the freeway? No, no, I'm, uh... I'm not like directly beside the freeway. Okay, I thought I seen something sparkling in there. No. <laughs> what are y'all doing, guys? We are waiting for a handoff. The cartel leader or somebody supposed to be buying a card that allows you to go to the laundry, money laundering area or something. I don't even know where that is. So, once we do this, we kind of find out who it is and what they look like and everything. So, it, by doing that, we gain a little bit of information. And then after this, if the air warrant got approved, search warrant, then we'll go search that house and see if we can find anything in it. Alright, so I called this feller. He said he was on his way back, but he's, uh, he's not here. Marshall Chen to everybody else. What do you yeah, mean here? That. Yeah, I tried calling him again to see what kind of vehicle he's going to be in, and uh, I'm getting a busy signal. <sighs> did we ever. I don't know uh, what happened because I just talked to him. Did we ever get a, uh, a, a warrant? No, they, they called back. Judge, it, it, judge won't sign it. Wow! The subpoena for the records. We got the subpoena for the records, but we can't get a warrant. Correct. The warrant for the for the house is based on uh, rumors or information from other people, and they're not legitimate people. Yeah, but the suspect living there literally got uh, arrested and had drugs on her. Yeah. The house was bought after she got caught. Probably by the money. <laughs> yeah, so he won't sign up. They said possibly tomorrow. <sighs> well, there goes yeah, that. So that's where we're at now. Well, 
All right then. Uh, we had a car pull in the other parking lot over there. Looks like a black SUV. I don't know if it's a local or if it's actually somebody uh, rolling up. Where it looks like where, a BMW where or exactly? a Bentley. Uh, it's going to be, uh, Uncle. You know, over there, where in between where he pulled in the first time, between the Yala and the Blue uh, Building. It's going to be between the Blue Building and the the White Roof. All right, I just called him. Yes, he's in a black SUV. That is him. Okay, well he's on the okay. wrong side. He needs to come on this side. He wants you to. He wants him to go on that side. No if, can do. If you go outside, I can't see it. You, you're, you'll be a sitting duck. All right, I'll text him and tell him to go on the other side of the building. Tell me he's out of gas or a most out. I mean, literally, he can come <laughs> to my car. And see it. <laughs> Sounds like the jig thought want to do his job. Well, the thing is, like now we have to have the information right. connected to this. But I think if she's been arrested, had Everybody drugs on her, and, and we got a warrant for the out. for the um, like company she worked at and everything, we should be able to get one for her house. I mean, because like if she bought the house after all this happened, she got fired. Where'd that money come from? She's buying a house and don't right, have I a just job. I texted him, asking, telling him that we're out of gas, uh, and asking him to go to the other entrance. So I guess we we'll have to get with the DA yeah, and try our best. Pulling out now. He he went to the other parking lot. Cool thing is, we are going to get it, so you'll be able to see the paperwork and everything like that. So we'll have actual paperwork, and I'll just say, you know, here here's a document or something. I can't wait for that. It's going to be awesome. Tell him it's on the highway side of nine three two four. I see him right now. He's coming around. Yep, he's getting ready to pull in in just a second. Okay, Don't talk with your radio. Yeah. There you go. He just. Oh my gosh. Like. He's going down below. Like, how freaking. Tell him he Four. just passed. He turned into the the road beside it. It's the road in front of it. Hey, pull your car out and and go at that road right there. Like just stay at the be uh like at the entrance there. You should be able to get warrants for all our stuff, cars included. Yeah, that's I mean I'm. Well, I guess since we're trying to get a warrant after all this happened, we probably could have got it when she was arrested, but apparently she didn't have the house. But I don't know. I mean, if she's still under investigation, I feel like we'd be able to. All right, he's coming He's coming back, coming back around. Oh, my gosh. Like, like apparently... Is that him that just passed me? I don't know, but if this is a daggone the leader, then we should have no trouble taking him down. looking for him or what? Yeah, he literally is driving by the exit. Like, he drove by the exit he's supposed to and then took the one right beside it. Stand there at the side right there. Like, when you come in, just stand there. That way, he'll, he'll see you just, you know, standing around. Oh, right, there he is. He's, he's on the way. Go All right, right there, right there, right there. All right, it's nighttime right now, so I think we'll be okay if we stand up. Because there's no way they can see me. His plate is literally blocked by a pole. Like, how does that even happen? Tell me that is not perfect parking. Golly. Man. 
I'm hoping he don't say, hey, text me or something. Like seriously, like how does that happen? Dude, that's their luck. I got eyes on the plate, but I can't get too far. I can't make it out. Believe it or not, you want us to bull crap? He parked perfect where I can't see it because of the pole. Be advised, he's flying out and flying back in. His pockets seem to be giving him trouble. I'm going to get a plate. <laughs> 10 4. Uh, is somebody write this down. Hey, tell it to me real slow. I'll, I'll send it to you. Be advised the plate is scratched out. The lights need to be on for me to see it. Hey, can you see me over here? No. Perfect, perfect, perfect. <clears throat> I'm telling you, that guy parked that car like perfect. Try to get an eye on it when he leaves or something like that. Is the vehicle unlocked? How you gonna be long uh, live for? Um, I don't know. Um, I try to go to twelve. It just depends on yeah you know, what's happening and everything. I'm like super tired. I, I actually took a little quick. nap. <laughs> <laughs> Where we came in. Clean. The advice that what is that Lincoln or a... Lincoln or a Cadillac? BMW. BMW. Well, did we get confirmation on the last four of that plate? I don't need to have the Cadillac because um, I, I kind of stole them uh, muscle car. <laughs> okay, he's back. He's back. He's back. Oh, I can see his plate. I can, but I can't. Be advised. I can see the plate a little bit. Looks like eight two. H O maybe. All right, confirmation. It's a uh, eight uh, Zulu Hotel Umbrella, 2023 BMW X7. Bingo. It's registered to Sean Cor uh, Cornwell. 
now since we have that confirmation I can see all vehicles and all plates for this person. I feel like that's a big step. I feel like it's a pretty big step in this whole case. Shows an apartment on Integrity Way also. No other businesses. Negative. Be advised, suspects now getting back in his car. Be advised, he paid with marked bills. He paid with marked bills, but you gave him a key. Like, how you going to change uh, it? 10 for a day, but that's good. That's good he paid with marked bills, because that means that's, that he's doing yeah. something. That's why I didn't, I didn't say anything. All right, I'm giving him a little time to drive away, and I'm going to head on to my truck. Where are we meeting? I don't know, but we need to definitely discuss this. We need to meet somewhere. Let's just go to the uh, to the Marshall Station. Oh, tell me that was like good. We got we got some intel. It's great. Before you do that, uh, baby, baby Gray, you want to see if your contact is uh, around? Uh, which contact? The Nikki chick. Yeah, I can call her. Well, what, 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 what do you want me? What do you want me to do? Just talk to her? Or? We need we need a whole conversation with her. She's been lying to us. Well, let me let me call and see if she's doing anything, and I'll I'll I'll, uh, I'll tell you what. I'll tell her maybe somewhere. I'll tell her to get in the truck, and I'll meet y'all somewhere. Sounds good. Hey, be advised. He didn't give me his name, but he gave me his uh, street name. We got it's the plate. Guy. Oh, okay. Well, we know well, every it? we know every vehicle he drives now and everything. Oh snap! You got a name on him? That's Sean Conwell. What's the what's the street name he gave you? Guy in the white hat. That literally is street name. Wow, boy, he's created. Yeah, hey, he's real crazy? nice. Hey. Hey. What's up? Hey, get in the truck. Okay. Let's go ahead and go to MRPD and, and catch up on some stuff real quick. 10 4 each other. How you doing? I'm doing good. Yeah, I was just about to call you. Needle, don't park that car over by the PD. Uh, park yeah. it down in the alley and walk. Yeah, I was just about yeah, to tell I you, I just need to talk to you a couple, uh, about a couple things. What have you been into? Um, working. Working on trucks and stuff. Getting all my trucks set up. Hey, it's a green light. Yeah, sorry about that. Now, uh, one buddy just texted me. Apparently he beat you. He just bought a new car. Oh, Be advised. Um, but no, I've been working on little great uh, message me. He said uh, Nikki is in his truck at the moment. Okay. You been working well in your house? We got uh, a. Uh, well, I take him to a shop. Is he just going to do that on his own, or we going to be? Things that I'm not sure. Uh, gonna I'm sure he's going to text stuff. me some more with the dates. She knew if you want to pull that car over here, you can park it on the ground. Okay. Yeah, I was gonna call you and everything. I yeah, drove I by. I was that. like, wait a minute. I'm like, is that Nikki? He just messaged me parking building behind PDM. Oh uh, yeah. Okay. Is that is that your new shop back there? Ten four. I walk that way. Was that where you uh, work or? No, I. Oh shoot, never mind. Uh, Greg, is you close to MRPD? I'm underground garage. Need 
need to text him and see if he mm. wants to do it alone or if he wants everybody. Yeah, I just text and ask if he needed me there. Are you there? Maybe of that, I think she had a headache and everything, but I was literally driving down the road and seeing her running up the sidewalk. Uh, meet me at the uh, building uh, right behind, beside uh, ammunition. Top of the way. garage? Uh, yeah, at the very top. I want to wait here and uh, hopefully uh, she gets her head straightened up. Alright, 10-4. Kilo Western 20, we'll come get you. Lock the door. I'm at the parking building right now. Uh, yeah, I think so. But I think they can unlock the door too, maybe. Um, Where hopefully she comes back in. Tell me that was a lot weird. Like, I was driving, I was like, oh, Where garage door open. Didn't know the uh, shop was there, and bam. Lot. So, hopefully, right. Be there in back in. 10 4. Hopefully, comes back in, and then we can see what's going on. Is that a local or is that a. I don't know if it's local or not. Is that needle texting me back? Yeah. What if I. Back on. I know. That is crazy. I think it was because. Uh, I don't know if it's cause crashed or what. You forgot it was Thursday? Ha! <laughs> well, shame on you, Chevy boy. Nah, I'm just kidding. Um, to be honest, sometimes I forget. Like, I was like, what in the world? It's like, yesterday I kept thinking it was like Friday for some reason. Well, thank you. I, we, we put a paint job and did some different rims and stuff. Trying to make it look a little different. I don't know if... Be advised, I don't know if she's going to get a flight back in or what. You said at the top of the parking building, right? 10 4. Yeah, I'm over here on the corner across from the Flicka Bank waiting. My cone fell over. <laughs> okay, we see you. Yeah, be advised. I did. I, I don't know if it's because she had a headache or what, but she was in that shop, and I was like, "Hey, is that your new shop or where you work at?" And she's and it was like, yeah, and then like said, "Never mind." So does anybody know who? Hang on, let me get a postal. What was that shop? We came across here. Where did we come across? Where's that shop at? Here? Alright, uh, I'm seeing that uh, she's getting quite a bit of headaches. You want to just meet, meet a, a location and debrief? Yeah, hey, who owns the shop? Do we know anybody owns a shop at 8198? Yeah, I'm going to get Let a, me take a look. You my phone for this thing. Uh, that's correct. It's going to be a garage right here on the hill. Not yet. They haven't moved there yet. Well, uh, she was in there nosing around. Really? That's where, uh, that's where Slipknot's supposed to be moving to. Well, she uh -huh. might, might not hate that place as much as we think. I'm at the top of the building up here. Dude, everything from her isn't what we think. First it was, I only do a little bit to finding out she's a mule. 35. They probably just have her feeding us false information, to be honest. To be honest, I feel like we need to go talk to that guy. We need to talk to somebody from Slipknot's that's high up and put them in the room and say, listen, like, we know a lot of crap about you, and, like, you about to go down for uh, tax invasion. Like, you either tell us the crap you know or, you know, face being in jail and having everything you got taken away. I dropped her off at that corner where she jumped out my truck at. 35. 
crazy thing is, like, I was driving by, and I was like, and I seen her. I was like, what? Because I seen the door open. So I was like, I pulled, I pulled up and said, get in my truck. And uh, that's why I didn't want to tell you, like, hey, I got her or whatever. We, I figured, yeah, we just come here or whatever. But I asked her, I was like, is that your new shop or where you work at or something? She's like, oh, never mind. And, but her, she got a headache. She, you know, didn't get to tell me everything. But if that's where they're moving to, tell me that ain't a... That Bum ain't some, of shit. yeah, dude. I'm telling you, we're getting, we're getting, we're going around in circles. Huh. We're getting pulled around. Well, they know they're being, you know, targeted. So I don't know. I'm to the point now where I say we arrest every last one of them, throw them in jail, and say, "Well, you're staying here until somebody can talk." Well, okay, so, I mean, we know that guy that I just met up with, I mean, we know he's guilty of something, because literally I just sold him something and he gave me Mark Bills, so, Yeah, he's the, he's the head of the cartel name we got from the guy we met uh, last week at the gas station. Yeah, but right. if you try to, like, say if we try to put him in jail for that or whatever, like, he gonna be in there a little bit because when he's gonna be like, oh, I got that from somebody else or something, you know? Exactly. Yeah. He's too high up. We need someone lower on the food chain that was snitch on him. I'm, I tried calling the Silver Dollar Auction, you know, a runner or something because the runners they like they know everything, you know. They got they know schedules, what's going on, what they're doing, right, and everything. So, yeah, we we need to find Michael. Let me look it up because he has a business. If it's a business that we could possibly use, we can we can try to do what we're doing at Silver Dollar and see what happens. Actually, somebody just tweet out and say you need to say I need to sell some used cars. See if any answers. Well, I've been trying. I've, I've been trying to call. Who was the Who was the one? Was Michael Todd? Is that the one that worked at the Silver Dollar? Ten four. I mean, we called the sucker and be like, "Hey, I work there. I got uh, some used cars. Can you Can I meet you there?" Roll up and talk to that sucker. That's not far from that's here. That's SNS pistol. That's I'm pretty sure it's a that's a that's a cop pistol. I hear it Yo, too. I just, I just heard I the hear shots though. Here. Come on, yeah. needle. Come on. Is there a target range down here? But it's under you. That's right across from the PD. Someone's shooting near PD. I feel like somebody's trying to get her attention from somewhere. I feel like somebody's trying to get her attention. Right? Hey, I just got a, a tweet from that Michael T. Be advised, it's that white BMW. Which way to go? Say a white BMW? Hey, uh, Mr. All Black, you should not be saying a word anytime soon. Yeah, I'm I got you, go ahead. I feel like, oh my, I feel like the, oh, I feel like this is a... Yeah, I bet you little fucks have been waiting for this, just getting your dick hard, getting that fucking gunshot ring. Fuck. Fuck. What the heck is... Hey, what are you down here shooting for? I'll turn myself in. 
Shooting, shooting your weapon. Turn yourself in. Hey, don't ask well, no questions. Let's do the He's city looking for us to do something. Might as well make a scene to get him here. So I shot up the windows of your stupid little place. Oh, we'll check the front door. Uh, All right, Trooper, I haven't you said a word because uh, I don't All know right. if he knows so who yours. I am or not. I take him. Yep, right. he was shooting, uh, shooting weapon out here. That's all we know. Might wanna, oh, might wanna definitely check, check him. Actual, yeah, oh, check whoa, 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 You want a name too? Because I guarantee it'll get you guys really hard once you know the name. Yeah, he already knows his name. Yeah, go ahead, what's that? Yeah, that'll be the man in the white hat, or as you guys know, the redhead with the white hat, and Sean Cornwell. The cartel leader of the Death Angels. <laughs> what made what makes you think you're on our radar? Uh, because I do know you're on your, you're on my or I'm on your radar. Come on now, I'm running the most coke in this fucking city. Uh, be words on the street. I say you wish you were, but I know you ain't. Hey, did he say the Death Angels cartel? I mean, I'm, I'm U.S. Marshal with the Big Mother Humpers. <laughs> what? We need to start saying that. <laughs> well, we know where the coke comes from. Need a hush. Your voice travels. Literally, I'm a football field away from it. And you sound like a freaking bass drum. Shush. You whatever. Hey, I feel like that was a distraction for something. A, cor a cartel leader wouldn't do that. You can get in a truck. Hey, you know what? All right, listen. This is the third time today I brought up this, but y'all remember in uh, Fast and Furious, like the cartel leader had like a, a a cover, but that guy was out in public, but it, they thought it was somebody else. I'm just saying. I mean, to be honest, a cartel leader wasn't going around like saying he's the head of the cartel. So you might be onto something there. Well, my thing is, like, we won't even, we'll let, like, uh, Chin said, we'll let the troopers do everything. We won't even have to, we won't even worry about it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, my main concern is just, like, slip my place. Hey, uh, this uh I guess Michael T is wanting to meet at seven two two or seven two nine nine. Do y'all want me to go there or what? Yeah, we'll meet you. Seven is it seven two two nine? Uh it says meet me at seven two two nine. We're seven two two nine. Repeat that uh address. I like how you put y'all y'all left me with no vehicle. <laughs> seven two seven two two nine. Where the crap is seven two two nine? Seven two eight nine. Seven it's like I'm the world's worst at seven two nine nine. Seven two nine nine. I, like I, I'm overlooking it. Like I know I am. Eight. We're here, champ. There's seven two eighty. So what was his overall? Oh, we don't have postal. Is it? Is it the casino? Uh, yeah. We we gonna like this one. 
Hey, be advised, that's going to be at a biker location. Trying to, he's trying to set himself off as a martyr so we can stop looking at the carpet. Well, be advised, I'm just saying, did you hear my Fast and Furious, uh, like, uh, thing? Yeah, I was, I was talking to some weird dude that wanted to turn himself in. But, I mean, really, I mean, though, it like, could... it could be a face. I mean, he might not even be the guy. I mean, because, like, would you go around saying, I'm the leader of the cartel? If you're dumb, you would. I... All I know is something had to have happened from the time that he met up with our guy for a laundry cart and him shooting out. Who did I pick up? Exactly. There you go. There you go. All right, I'm rolling up right now. Um, y'all want me to wait on y'all, or? We're here. Okay, we're, we're right, right, right around the corner. Okay. Yeah, we just saw your little grave behind speed past. I don't like this. Everybody's playing everybody, because nobody wants to get caught. Be advised, I'm going to... Like, oh, who's this guy? Put your hands up. What's the problem? What's your name? Which? It's Michael. What's last, your last name? name? Todd. Oh, we need to have a talk. Okay. You got an office or something around here? Uh, it's not working right this minute. Oh, it's not working. No. Would you rather us take take you with us? We'll drive past all your friends and let them see you in the back of the building. Where do you want to find out? No, hers ain't working. Well, this one's working. Oh, hey, hey, I got it, I got it, I got it. Hey, uh, hey, Chen, um, the owner of the auction place, uh, his phone's ringing. Do you want me to go talk to him? Hey, do you want me to go talk to him? Yeah, Follow see if Nadal. he knows what's going on with all this crap. Okay, yeah, I'll just see, you know, like, hey, you know, we suspect this. Hello, is this, uh, was it Nate from Silver Dollar Auction? Yes, it is. Hey, how you doing? This, uh, this is, uh, Marshall Gray. Um, is there any way, uh, we can meet so I can speak to you? Yeah, where you at? Um, where are you at right now? I am... 7298. Standing on the sidewalk. Okay. Do you have a, uh, I'll tell you what, can we meet you at your, uh, auction house? Um, yeah. I would say give me a couple minutes and I'll meet you down there. Alright, well actually we'll take you there, alright? Alright. I'm guessing it's the same. Is that you? Yes it is. Alright, hop in. That wasn't suspicious. Yeah, no, real. Hey, how you doing? Hey, what's going on? I'm telling you, I'm on the... I'm on it. Hey, uh, can you go ahead and put the marker in for your, uh... Uh, your shop. <laughs> I'm like at where everybody is, apparently. Alright, thank you. Uh, Uncle, do you want to talk to him, or you, you want to drive and let me talk to him, or what? Yeah, I'd drive. Alright. I know this seems a little strange and everything. All right, so you're the owner of the Silver Doll Auction, right? You, you got to hand me the keys, nephew. Well, it's one of those you just, you know. Yeah, sometimes you forget. But yeah, I am the, the owner of that. All right, um, you have a, uh, what's the employee's names that work for you? I have uh, Ashton, Cade, and uh, Michael Todd. All right, it's Michael Todd. How much you know about him? I mean, 
He's been working with me since the day I got the auction. So Disney, I know, thank you for I the raid. I know everything. Okay. Um, so how long you say he's been working with you since you started, or? Yeah, since I got the auction house. All right, he seemed like a pretty good guy. He seems straight and good to me. All right. Um, you ever see him buying a lot of stuff or anything? I mean, I'm, I'm sure like you pay him good, but do you ever see him buying stuff that you think, hey, I don't pay him that good? Mm, maybe once or twice, but I knew he was doing a, a another job when we weren't doing the auction. Well, what job would that be? Uh, he was doing the recycling job. Recycling job. Okay. Is that that's what he told you? Yeah, that's what he was telling me. Oh, okay. Um, do you know who he hangs out with or anything? I mean, I know you're his boss. You don't know everything about him, but you kind of learn your employees. I mean, for the most part, I'm pretty. He's usually with me, or he's with uh, a Jack Huff. And other than that, I don't know who he hangs out with. To be honest with you. Okay, Jack Huff. Is that his friends? Yeah, he's our he's our transport guy for the uh, for the auction. Okay, okay, I got you, I got you. All right. And we just we we're just interested in you know what he does and what some of his habits. My my officers actually uh, the other officers actually talk to him and stuff. I just wanted to talk to you about everything. Oh, okay. Yeah. I mean, he hasn't done anything that I've seen off or anything. I mean, he's usually. Unfortunately, he's usually standing in the parking lot with me, staring at my ugly mug. Okay, so you're around him a lot. Quite a bit, yeah. Okay, and it, what? Does he work any other jobs that you think, or as you said, any other things? You know that he's a, a you know, driver or anything like that. I know he was trying to do uh, like transport for people, but that really hasn't panned out since Jack's been doing a lot. Like what kind of transport? Just cars from the auction. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. All right. Um, what about the other characters? Uh, what uh, Ashton, Cade? Yeah, they're they're not in city very often, so I don't know a whole lot about them right now. Okay. All right, yeah, no, we're just, uh, we're doing an investigation, and we, we're just, we're wanting to learn everything we can about, uh, Mr. Todd. Okay. Did he, did he do something wrong that, uh... Uh, no, not right now. Oh. <laughs> yeah, no, okay. though, like I said, we're just asking, you know, about him and everything like that. All right, I just want to make sure I ain't got to fire him just yet. No, no, I wouldn't fire him or anything like that. Um, Gray, do you got anything to say to him or ask? Now, you know, well, anything you say about old Huffy, the one you was just talking about? Yeah, tell us about uh, him. Oh, Jack. As far as I know, he he's usually in city when I'm not around, but he when he is, he's usually hanging out with me and old Michael Todd there and usually at the casino a lot. I don't have Chin's number. <laughs> but other than okay. that, I mean, he just, he's a tow truck driver and a transporter. So he goes to the casino a lot? Yeah. Over the last couple couple days, couple weeks, whatever. Okay, we go ahead and step out. You're not in trouble or anything. We just want to ask you some questions. I've been trying to get a hold of you and everything. Oh, yeah, I had some side activities that I had to take care of today. Okay, okay, I got family. you. All right, well, we'll step over and make a call. If, if y'all want to just chill, I'll be right back. Marshall Needle to uh, the Grays. Y'all got a status? Uh, be advised, um, he hasn't really said anything about him or anything. He did say he hangs out with a... Was it a Jack Huff? He's supposed to be a tow truck driver, so it might be another one we can talk to. Okay, yeah, this uh, this guy we just talked to, uh, he said he's good friends with the Huff brothers. 
Yeah, that was one of them camp kind of brought up because he said apparently they get the casino a lot or something like that. I feel like that's something to watch out for. He, I asked him if this, uh, you know, this Todd spends a lot of money or anything, and he said that um, there's a couple purchases questionable, but he said that he, you know, w was he was doing a second job of recycling. Okay. But, I mean. I don't know. I don't know how good recycling pays these days, but uh Exactly. You still down there? Uh affirmative. Yeah, ask wanna... him ask him what he knows about uh people within that business uh having L S D. Make sure you say I mean, people. Kinda put your house on the map. Are you talking about what business his? Yeah, the auction house. Okay, I just want to make sure. Right. Well, my address is six zero three zero. Okay. All right, Mister. Uh, Mister, what's your last name? Eight. Uh, my name's. My last name's H. Mister H. Okay. I got a question. Um, do you uh know any peoples that would? like have LSD or anything like that? Uh, none that I know of. Anybody that would like deal in it or, you know, that would know of, you know, where you get it from, you know, where you get it from or anything? You're not going to be in trouble or anything. I'm just asking you a question. Nah, it's I, raining hard here now, yeah, so hopefully my internet... None that I know of. I mean, I try and stay away from all that stuff. I got a business to run. I'm trying to open up a new one on the other side of town. Okay, all right. So you don't know anybody? I mean, does any of your, like, workers may know somebody or something? Well, like I said, I think, mo um, as far as I know, they're all pretty much on the straight and narrow. Unless they're doing stuff behind my back, but... Well, I mean, how, how good do you know your employees? Like, uh, Mr. Todd, like, how good do you know? I mean, would you trust them, like, with, you know, information and stuff like well, so, I, mean, I mean something you know with your life enough to let him stay with him yeah he, he does live in my house he I does mean, live I, in your house i don't go through his stuff and I don't, if you so, don't mind let me get that address one more time six zero three zero thank you sir okay so he stays with you i mean does he have any friends coming or going None that I know of. Give me a minute. I'm not always around either. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay, I got gotcha. you. All right. And then, like, does he have his own, like, you know, stash in his room and everything? Yeah, as far as I know, he does. Okay. All right. Yeah, we're just doing, like, some questions, but I, I want to see what, uh, what they're saying and everything, and we should be good, all right? Alright, sounds good. <laughs> it just does it. Oh my gosh. Another location in case we were going to look for him. Well, Todd said he used to do, he used to deal LSD while he was working. He dealed it here? Yeah, he yeah, said that while he, he, was working he here. was working here and dealing LSD. Well, this, I mean, like, like, I'm sorry, but, like, this is the second owner of a business that they say, oh, I don't know anything going on. I'm sorry, but my business, I don't know everything my employees do if it's on my parking lot, you know? Yeah, but not especially if, smart as great. Especially if they're buying vehicles left and right, and you're not giving them the money. What's up, John? I don't know. Oh, uh, you're good? We need to get some more info and some more help you, uh, help his family. Oh, well, okay, I got you. I was good to help family. Said he was selling here. We definitely need to check here. Oh, well, does he have sale? a place of residence beside? Because he says that he stays with this guy. He's got his own stash in his room and everything. Oh, he does. He has a stash in that room. Because well, if not... so, then this guy can go into that stash. I mean, if I was going to have something, people, well, if I if I, I would stash it there because I mean we would have never known. Well, as soon as we stopped talking to him, he left when we left. So. Well, I think we need to go pick up Mr. Todd and go over to the house and have him open his own stash and let us look. 
but you need to do it discreet so he don't warn this fella. Yeah, but you gotta, but you gotta party. have, you gotta have him do it voluntarily. If yeah, not, I mean, why you get a warrant for that bull crap? Think, and I don't think he's, he's got do it voluntarily. Yeah, well, here's the thing, though. Like if he's gonna, cause. if he's gonna try to, I mean, oh, to be honest, if we can, cold. if we can tell, talk to this guy right here. I mean, like he's living in his house. Right, this guy can do it. If we can get confirmation for him, we can walk in there. There you go. Well, I mean, you're going to have to get it where he don't call him and ask him and stuff. Well, we'll make sure he don't call. Actually, i tell you what. Hey, before you do that, why don't a couple of us go ahead and head over to that address just to make sure he don't get there before y'all do? Uh, yeah, y'all go over there, scope out the place, and then I'll bring him over there so he can unlock it for us. All right, I'll Sounds ride good. with you. I'll ride with yeah, you. Yeah, I'll call a vehicle in. Hey, real quick, before you walk away. What's your phone before, number? Before, uh, who, me? I don't think I have it. Uh, oh, I just want to make sure, because I was going to call you. I'm pretty sure I don't have it. There you go. So before, uh, before uh, the cartel guy got pulled off by uh, the FBI, because I, I think he thinks that was a regular trooper. That was the FBI? Yeah, I was there. <laughs> yeah, let them uh, handle it. He said, uh, last second, he said, hey, if you check my pockets, you're going to see a, a automatic weapon, and I got it from the commissioner, Larry. Oh, snap. And I have the gun on me. Well. And he's going to talk to them regarding, I think the FBI is going to make a deal with him. Uh, because. Dude, I'm telling you, they need to make a deal, and they need to get all the crap on Larry we can. There you That's go. the third source we heard that he's been giving. All right, well, I want to go get work. him and everything. Yeah, that way right, we're not do, letting him. Yeah, do that. We'll, keep, me, keep, and, uh, keep, me and him will talk talking for a minute. Let's make the court trial later. I'll be that would be some crazy crap. All right. Sorry about that. No problem. We just got a lot of paperwork. No, like, we're just chasing down some leads hey, are y'all two going to go or y'all need me to go? Okay. Now you hang with him and just keep him talking. Give us time to get over there. But uh, yeah, that'll work. So how, like, so he, how long has he been living with you and stuff? And I know I keep going back to him, but I'm trying to find out I can about every one of your employees, just thoroughly. Um, I mean, I've only had my house for a few days, so as far as I know, he's only been there a few days too, because I only gave him keys to it the day after. Okay, so how long? I so it's just a few days and everything. Does he go there a lot, or is it just one of those just like, eh, every now and then I roll in? Yeah, I'm guessing it's every now and again because half the time we fall asleep here or whatever. I gotcha, I gotcha. And uh, now, does he have another place? None that I know of other than the shop that he's got over there at 7299. Seventeen. Okay. Okay. I got you. I got you. Yeah. I was, I was wondering like whose garage that was and everything, because like, they talked to him and everything. Oh, did they? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. We. Were, that's why we were there when you were like, I'm a seventeen nine eight. I'm like, okay. This is like the second time today. I literally looked for somebody. And they were legit right beside me. Like that's. <laughs> nice. So, yeah. Uh, I, I literally just. I actually just flew in and uh, ran over there because that's about where I f flew out last night. Okay. All right. And tell me uh, some more about the with the Huff brothers. Yeah, that's what I was fixing to ask. What would you like to know about them? Anything you just, know, like anything interesting yeah. that if an officer was asking you, you'd be like, hey, you know, this is like suspicious or something. Well, I know Buck Huff. He's he's the oldest brother. And uh, he's straight laced, just basically does work. He works for, uh, he does work for the recycling business. And then he's got a bar that he's been trying to get open at the top of the city over there, over at the, the old Tequila Laws. But uh, that hasn't been opened yet. It was still under construction last I knew. But. All right. What about that, the? Uh, what you say? What now? Jack, which one's a tow truck driver? That'd be Jack. And like I said, most of the time when I'm around, he's busy towing cars or moving cars for other people. Or if we have an auction that day, he's hauling cars for customers. 
Okay. All right. So he's basically working all the time. Yeah, pretty much. And if he's not doing that, I know he does the recycling job from time to time as well. Okay. So basically, all, everyone has kind of like a second job to make a little bit extra money. Yeah, because this place, it doesn't make a whole lot of money all the time. It's just kind of random when we do uh, auctions. Okay. All right. So, um, do you know a guy named Cameron? I don't know if you ever been asked this or not. Uh, I do know a Cameron. Um, he's one of the guys that uh, most of us around here, these parts don't get along with. Okay. Why is that? Just because just just he's don't always. Like him. He, yeah, he's just always acting childish, wanting to do dumb things around people. And he's, he's acted a fool during an auction one time and. Just, well, I got a question. I talked about the LSD. I mean, do you think he would be on it or something, acting fools and stuff? I mean, would that be something that you think he'd do? I mean, it's a it's 100% possible, but I don't know him well enough to know what he acts like on a normal basis. I don't know if he's just trying to show off to people and act a fool that way or whatever, but for the most part, I don't know a whole lot about him. I just know that I don't like to be around him. I got gotcha, you, I got gotcha. you. So, uh, you ever got a Slipknot Customs in any, or? I actually have not at all. Okay. All my cars get used to get done by JBS. Hey, y'all good? Great, uh, gray. Y'all good? 10 4. All right, we good? So, do it. All right, sorry about that. Like, oh, you're good. All right, Diesel, you have hey, a good did night. Y'all arrive at the postal. Four, go ahead. All right. Okay. So we got a question for you. All right. All right. So we just get waiting on confirmation. All right. So Michael Todd. Okay. He was staying with you, which you own the house, you own you know everything like that. Would you give us consent to search his room? I mean. And I will tell you this, like on terms that. We do believe, and we have really good sources, that there was drugs being sold in your parking lot under your like under your nose. You didn't even know. Wait, in what parking lot? This parking lot? This place right here. Hmm. Be advised that I have charger is leaving here. that place. I mean, I guess bush, like he came from a mountain. You all got a, So he may have already come in and cleared uh, it out or something. Uh, I mean, I guess I can't argue. Yeah, I mean, yeah, like I said, we. Not anything I knew about. But will you uh, like give us consent? Because if not, then yeah, we it's will get a warrant. But lock. we're scared he'll. If there's anything in your house, he'll be can moving. Get it. to it without being seen. Uh, I mean, yeah, sure. Can I be there? We're working on. We'll take the you there. Barrel. Like you'll be uh, unlocking the I mean, door for us, and you'll be with us. See why we can't All right. go in the car on the I property. just we I can't have you contact him or anything like that. No phone, no nothing. Because if yeah, we do no, roll in, I want to be you know. No, I, I get that. Yeah. And if you want, you can tell them that we served you with the warrant, and that's why you let us in. Okay. Yeah. I mean, no. That's fine. I have no problem with it. Like I said, I ain't got nothing to hide. So. All right. Well, let's roll. Um, um, you put the GPS in my truck, and we're heading there. All right. Uh, be advised, we did get a confirmation. We are on our way. All right. Put the GPS in there. We roll. Can y'all hear me? Yep. Yeah, you're ready to roll. The problem is, is that the charger's already here. It's hiding behind some trees by the driveway. Yeah, the GPS is kind so of So I imagine janky. he's already going to come in and clear whatever go it was up in the there out. Second light, turn left. Okay, well, we got down, consent from, himself. you know, the owner of the house. So okay. We got consent to go in the house. Like, I mean, we hope we, he didn't clear it out, you know. Yeah, right, now go ahead and proceed. I don't see him. All I see is the car. All right, did the GPS fix itself? Okay. I mean, maybe he just parked it there. Who knows?
Oh, it's taking you the wrong way. We'll just go straight, because it's up in the mountains, right? No, well, you have to go down by uh, the court center. Turn left here. Nope. Go the way. I was looking at the GPS, and when you told me that, kind of look at me. Yeah, it, like I said, it uh, the GPS kind of threw it off. It reads like it's up in the hills, but it's really not. Turn right at this one. Yeah, there you go. Now you can follow the GPS. All right. Golly, it's thundering here. <laughs> I hope I don't lose power. As soon as we get there, watch that be my luck. But yeah, it's thundering here. My internet might be acting up a little bit. I do apologize. But if it lags here or something, um, it'll be on YouTube. And it shouldn't lag because it doesn't show, you know, when I'm recording it. But it still looks fine for me right now. Ah, oh, hell. It took you... You're going to have to go back down one road. I got to turn around? Down, it's, oh, yeah, I got to turn around? Us. Yeah. What's that? Be advised, GPS is... Wait, is it, yeah. is it down, down there? Below us. Yeah. Yeah, it's this last house in the cult sec where the gate is right in front of you. Oh, this one right here. Be advised we're on scene. All right. When you pull in, look to your left behind the trees. You'll see the charger. 10-4. Hey, y'all watch this, all right? I do, I see it. Hey, Mr. H, Mr. H, I got a question. There's a charger behind them trees. Is that yours? That is absolutely not mine. I don't know whose car that is. Hey, cover me. I want to see if somebody's in it. I want to see if there's somebody in it. Be advised, nobody's in it. All right, nobody's in that charger. All right, um, yeah, go ahead and unlock your door. Be advised, we are going in the house. I'm around back. All right, which is his room? Uh, all right, you just watch him back, all right? Okay. This is his room. Okay. All right, you give me sent to do this, correct? Yeah, go ahead. I guarantee you everything's already gone. Diving, oh, so. diving gear, red sulfur. Super Vakia racing harness. I guarantee if anything was in here, it's gone now. Yeah, plant fertilizer, laptop. All right, it's clean. Uh, we got a couple empty wee baggies and fertilizer and stuff. Oh, okay. So, do you know if that's his car or not? Be advised, you are around the trees. That'd be me. Ten four. Uh, we need to check the play on that. It looks like I sold them the other day. Okay. About a hundred percent. I can't see it from where I was standing, so. That's a KTM. All right. Um, let's go ahead and search for your house to make sure he's not hiding. All right, so if you just want to stand out here. Go 
Yeah, dang, this mofo is loaded. Alright, that's clear. Be advised, we're clearing the rest of the house. There wasn't anything that we seen. Um, dude, this place is nice. Might be a hidden spot down there. I don't know. All right, you don't have any hidden rooms or anything like that, right? Uh, just, uh, wait, hold on. I don't think so. Um, I thought there was, oh, no, never mind. That was my old house. I used to have an old wine cellar, but that was a different house. All right, um, do you have a stash in your bedroom? Yep. All right, um, do me a favor. Go ahead and just check it to make sure there's nothing that was put in yours or something. You know, transfer. All right, I'll look real quick. Yeah, precisely. Hey, there's a wine cellar down there. Make sure there ain't no like hidden doors. I mean, come, you know how that is, how that goes. Where through there? Yeah, straight down and it leads you down. All right, be advised, this house is uh, clear. I am having the owner check his stash to make sure nothing was transferred to his. 10-4. Wine cellar's clear. I mean, there ain't nothing out of the ordinary in there. I mean, I got a couple weed baggies and a knife and... Yeah, nothing like... Stuff. Okay. Alright, do you mind if I check? Go right ahead. Not saying I don't believe you, but I, paperwork, man. Uh, yeah, no, you're good. Go ahead. Good call. Uh, where's it at? I guess for the dresser. These people be loaded up here. Find it. Yeah, I found it. Alright. Alright, I'm gonna overlook that whatever that looks like an ATM device, alright? Oh. Eh. Something I, I picked up and found. <laughs> yeah, I ain't worried about that. Alright, did you clear the garage? Uh, I did not. Where's the garage? Straight ahead. All right, can we get you unlocked the door? Yep. Hold on, let me unlock it real quick. Clear. Left. All right. All right, clear. All right, everything's clear. He's got nothing, uh, nothing uh, in his uh, dresser. We even checked his. He lost. Check his. Nothing was in there. But I told him that if he wanted, we could. And, you know, he that is his friend, and I want him to have a vendetta against him. That we had a search warrant for this place. Yeah, we. I mean, he don't have to say nothing either. If we just leave, then. Yeah, just in case somebody sees something. But uh, but we we had a search warrant, and that's why we're here. Absolutely. You guys All right. Are there. All right, we're being called uh, up to the marshal office. So, okay, uh, from the FBI agent who wants to tell us stuff regarding that. Uh, hey, did we? Uh, guy. Did we know who the car that was? Yeah, he's the information now. Okay, because I swear if that's his car. You said that looks like the car you sold him. Yeah, it was one. I think I sold him the other day. Well, it looks like sure somebody got here awful fast. Don't you think? <laughs> I mean. If he come down the mountain and got stuck there, yeah, that's uh, obviously something going on. All right, well, I mean, I'll let you there's know there's my can. number. If anything suspicious or anything like that, you think your life's in danger or anything like that, you let us know. All right. Absolutely. I got your number. All right. So real quick, so the vehicle that's parked in the bushes belongs to the guy that's living here. Um, that's that's technically your property. Do you want that vehicle removed? Uh, I mean, if you want to remove it, that's fine with me. I mean, it kind of looks like an eyesore right there. Yeah, that, that's why I'm asking you. Like, you know, <laughs> when you walk out your house, do you want to see that? Yeah, not really. All right, it's gone. You, uh, if they don't have any questions for you, I don't. But have a good day. All right. Yeah, I'm all. I don't have any questions. Either. Like I said, we had a warrant, so. Yeah, absolutely. All right. All right. Have a good one. Thank you, uh, Mr. H. All 
All right, I guess we're en route to station. FBI agent has some juicy information regarding the troopers. <laughs> I'm telling you, we've got literally like 500. Dude, we've More got like five. I'm assuming. We've got like 500 cases going on right now. So <laughs> well, the crazy thing is, it all leads back to one big investigation. I'm telling you, I swear that cartel guy, I was a cover up. I'm sorry. People, unless it's like a really goofball cartel, you don't do that. But unless they just want to throw you off, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, you don't know what kind of games they're playing. All right, we're going... Are we going to the sheriff's office? No, the marshal. Marshal. marshal office, yeah. That's what I meant. Well, I hear, I hear thunder and everything. All right, how you saying live? Probably till twelve. But at least we get the information and stuff. I'm confused with everything to be honest. Okay, so here's the thing: we got brought in. Well, me and me and Dirt got brought brought in because apparently there it there was a Slipknot that was on illegal stuff. They got raided. All because of Nikki got arrested and had drugs on her, and she said that it came from them because I don't know why, or fired or something like that. And this is for everybody. So we got involved. They did a raid. They didn't find nothing, but apparently there was a secret location, is what we were being told. We they didn't know. I wasn't there for it. Um. So, we got brought in, that's when we talked to Nikki and everything, and we learned that apparently we have two dirty cops. Now, they are undercover. One is right now. The other one kind of spilled the beans on everything, but the other one is still undercover, but we think that they're really dirty. And Michael Todd is supposedly supposed to be a driver uh, like you know, deliver, delivering the drugs and everything like that, along with a couple other people. And Nikki is the one that is a driver too, or something like that. So everything's kind of coming together, but it's not. We've got to have a full blown case if we're going to do this, especially if you take down a whole cartel. But then we got to watch because we're taking. We don't know which is which. Like that Nate guy, he could be working for him. You know, I mean that's the thing. So it's like we can't really trust anybody. I mean, you don't even know about the marshals. I mean, I try to be straight and narrow, but if I got to plant drugs on somebody to have them arrested so we can uh, do a case, I mean, I'll do it. <laughs> I did steal a car and uh, commandeer it and everything. We're about, uh, about four clicks out. Yeah, it's raining here and thundering, but I don't think it... I don't think it's ran that bad because I don't hear it, hear it, like hitting my AC. How was your day? How are you doing? I'm doing good, Harrison. How are you? My day was actually driving old baby gray. What? See so you driving? Yeah, I'm back. Day. I'm back here riding the brakes so I don't push up the road. I gotta think about something for a minute. Y'all give me a sec. Ten four. I felt a little boost lag right there. Yeah, I definitely have to watch the stream and everything. Um, well, I'm glad you're doing good and everything. Today was real good. Like, I took the day off. I didn't really do any, you know, recording except for today. And uh, it was there. <laughs> and um, my daughter loves it when we make, like, a little fort under the table and stuff. So we made, like, a little fort with the blankets and stuff under the table. And uh, my son, he's like, like ten months old. He was sitting there. Uh, he he like crawl under the blanket and look around and like spin around, circle and crawl back out. It was great. He had a fun time. Golly, you can't park with crap, can you? So I did that on purpose. <laughs> Bet you did. Oh, hang on one second. I gotta put my gun up. 
Hey, we're up here. Why, in like every movie, uh, you know, TJ, what got you an RP? Um, just watching some YouTubers and everything. Uh, that's really what got me and everything. I thought that was that guy. I just watched some YouTube really got me and everything. Say swab you missed a lot. <laughs> hey, how you doing? Every pretty good, pretty good. Like any movies like that show FBI agents, they they're never really trustworthy. Have you ever noticed? That? All right, I guess we go ahead and step in here. Uncle's in timeout. He needs to be. He farted in my truck and locked the window so I couldn't roll him down. <laughs> All right, agent. So you arrested that cartel dude. Give us the info. All right. So I was arresting him. I asked him a couple questions. Come and... a little bit closer to, uh, to us over here my apologies are you able to hear me better yeah there you go oh yeah makes sense good okay so i asked him about the troopers who were corrupt and three names popped up joe dunn larry longmire and jay smith he said that he all provided ars of course police issued as well as pistols and handcuffs for things like monies and cars He, I also asked him about Slipknot, and he said that Cameron, Hunter, and Roman have hidden spaces in all their buildings, and they have drugs like LSD and cocaine. He also said that we should look into his bank accounts and all the assets he has. So this cartel he, literally yeah. just spilled the beans of like his whole entire fleet? I'm guessing. It sounds I like he did like... it literally on everybody. I mean, I don't I understand like why would you crap. do that, though. I mean, like, I mean, did he make try to make a plea bargain with you or, you know, to tell you this? He wanted life. He wanted life in prison. I feel like he might not be the true lead. And he's giving us all this information to distract us from whoever is within the cartel. I feel like the true cartel leader is after him. If he's wanting life in jail, he's probably scared to death. Yeah. He also said he wanted if he cut the death penalty. Yep. So I feel like that's what's going on. I mean, on. to be honest, I'd want the easy way out if I had a whole cartel like chasing me. I mean, I'm just yep. sorry, but. Do you have anything on him? Anything of interest? I have the AR that he had and the handcuffs, which are police issue. I also have an SNS pissed off of him. Now, you said that name was Joe Dunn? Yes, Joe Who Dunn. is that? Like, uh, it's the first time I've ever heard that name. How long has he been an officer? I'm unsure, but I looked into it. He uh, had the job of a sergeant with the state troopers. What is he now? He is, he says, uh, he's still a sergeant. Or I think a master sergeant. Right, is he on duty? Uh, at this time, let me check. Oh, he is. Uh, no. Mm. But it says Sierra... Sierra 54 is on duty, so whoever's that, they're on duty. Alright. Also, the guy had uh, 105 cocaine leaves. Stuffed in his in his pockets. And I'm sorry, but if wow. you are... If you are the leader, you're not going to be doing stuff. You're going to be sitting behind a table, counting your money, and having everybody else do stuff for you. 
Yeah, especially what he did tonight. That wouldn't have been. That's stupid. Clear. I mean, that that right there is an act of desperation not to get knocked off. Is he still in jail or is he out on bond or what? I sent him and I don't know. I think he left the city. Thank you for the information. No problem. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Dude, I tell you, I swear we're right, spinning you, circles here. We are. You can go, Agent. Let me walk you out. Oh, good grief. Hey, isn't there a song about uh, right, going around in circles? Spin me around? You spin yeah. me. There you go, okay. <laughs> Let's see if there are friends in town. I think she's having trouble. Do, do, do. All right, so what do we, uh, I say we just let the FBI and the DEA deal with the whole troopers. Be honest, I know that commissioner needs to be put in jail. I'm sorry. Like, if he, I don't care if he's daggone, like, if he's undercover, then he's going to be feeding us a bunch of bull crap. For all we know, he's probably the freaking leader. Actually, I wouldn't put it past that he's leader at this I point. I mean, to be honest, everything we have and everything, I think we need to, like, get a warrant for his arrest and at least... I mean, if we can get all the, you know, everything against him and everything and, like, get that guy to um, be, you know, testify against him in court, I, I mean. Yeah, and then he can relocate or whatever. Yeah, because if this guy literally went, shot at a police station, just get arrested and say, give me life, that's an act of desperation. I mean, we'll put him in witness protection or something, you know? Yep. Give him a new ID. All right, so... Wow, this is crazy. I think we should talk to Slipknot. Talk to Slipknot? I think we should. I think we should tell him, like, listen, you have a lot of high people, like, trying to blame a lot of crap on y'all. I mean, yeah, I, I feel like we need to, like, not tell them everything we know, but, like, there's a lot of people that's, like, some reason is trying to get you shut down. Yeah. You want me, you want me to see if they're still open? Uh, yeah, see if they're still open. Because, uh, if Roman's the only guy down there, I don't think he can help us. No, I don't, I don't, I don't know. I mean, maybe he might know some information, or just tell him, like, hey, why is everybody trying to bring down this company? I think Joe Dunn's, yeah, I, I've not heard of Joe Dunn or anything. Alright. I'm not... I've not heard of that Dunn guy, so if he if he's in it or anything, it, he must just have been pulled. I told you, it's um, like they're I going to try to get people. I know he's been around for a little bit. I know he's really good friends with Jay Smith, uh, so that could be how he got pulled into that. To be honest, like that guy, man, like he gave us a lot of good info, but it's like I don't. I mean, I don't know, like. At this point, it's like, what do we trust? I know for sure Nikki needs to go to jail. Yeah, next because time I find her. Not, oh, he, didn't, so yeah. he did not know it was us. He did not know anything until you picked her up. Yeah, so next time we see her, uh, rest her. I don't care if we gotta, like, put, we gotta, like, put coke on her or whatever. Like, she's going to jail and she's going to stay there until we find out what's going on. I agree. I mean, I got 105 cocaine leaves on Precisely. I mean, Dude, we'll do I got, something. I got Mark Bills. Huh. There you go. Hey, All wait, right. Well, we, I guess we hey, need to... We, uh, we can go at her as her being the lead. You know what? That's what we should say. We should say the cartel leader told us that you were actually the leader. Yep. And no, like, don't you're, say that. Just say we got told you're the leader, and that's what we're going with. Yeah, so we got told yep. you're the leader from a valuable source. And like you're being charged, and like just I mean everything, like yeah, everything. Yeah, Rico charges everything. Yep. Yeah, I feel like that's what we need to do to scare her enough to tell us 
the truth. Well, I think Slipknot's opening, so I think we need to ride down there and talk. I don't care. I don't care if that guy don't know dilly crap. I'm like, buddy, you're in a shit storm and you're part of it. You want to drive down there or fly? Uh, I'll drive. You want to fly? Drive. I'll drive. Dude, I'll fly. Just in case, yeah. All right. Um. Got you see, place of game. Like yeah, I know. But the thing is, though, I, I love it because it's all of RP and everything. But yeah, like you when you do that. stuff like that, I mean, it, it's going to get you. It's going to come back. And I feel like, oh, living like. Did y'all see a car over there flip? Looks like it went off the edges. No, so we're at the escape ramp, and it just started flipping. All right. I think you were standing too close to me when I had these cocoa leaves. I swear I seen something. <laughs> All right, let's rock and roll. I don't like flying. All right, we are gonna head to. Actually, you know what? Which way would be the quickest? Which, which road? Because they are right here. All right, so that road. All right. I see you down there, right in the middle of the lanes. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, the people that we're after, yeah, they're asking, they're asking for it. Now I see it's passing you. You got a Hemi in that Dodge, or is it just like you know? Yeah, yeah, it is, it is a Hemi. Call me the flying needle, boys. I swear, if I get pulled over, I, I might. Want to point out how, I want to point out how funny it would be if you got pulled over by Jay Smith right now. The uh, is he is you he back on the street, bro? Nice, I, I, don't, yeah. I just passed a cop. It was in a it was in a unmarked uh, Tahoe. The oh, well over a hundred. He might be Netflix. I must be. I turned my lights on. I turned went bad. <laughs> Storm of bad. Is it? All right, we're about to go talk to the guy, put some pressure on him. We're going around in circles, Katie, on this investigation. It's like, I feel like the whole daggone town's in it. Even living like Larry. Don't be living like Larry. Living like Larry is like a, like a crack cocaine slinger killer lobster about to break out my lobster cracker thing I go I'm feeling the boost leg I don't know what it is I need to I gotta clean my computer and everything every now and then it's like I did good then when I go back in the city what is that is that where I think it's a taxi driver Everybody saying hi, Katie. Hello. What's up, Epic, uh, Epic Gamer? Y'all there? Hey, we're here now. A, a gray car just pulled up. Not sure what kind it is. Yeah, it's a little lag, hey, but it ain't the stream. It's mine. For the owner, it's my, it's my, one day. my it's PC. A it's a Mustang. Is it okay? I think, was, that's, I, think that's, uh, I think that's one of that, the Mustangs that were in the shop. They've got a blue car headed down now on the overpass. Be advised, I'm rolling up to it now. I see a blue car. Rolling up now. Is that the Cadillac? That's two Mustangs. Nope, it's two Mustangs. Okay. One looks like a Shelby. Yeah, I can tell they're Mustangs now. Roman's running in the building. Hey, what's going on? What's going on, man? Hey, what's up? What's what's uh, what's y'all's names? 
So my what? name's Tyler. Tyler? Tyler. What's your name? Roman. Roman. All right, you work. Both y'all work here, or just one? I do. Okay. All right. Let's let's step down here. Did he just? Helicopter. Oh yeah. He hates ladders. Oh, well, I'm just, oh. I don't understand how they're. There, there's there's so ladders there. We gotta go there. through ladder training and dead go. Yeah, but they jumped off them. They're well, great jumped off the top. Well, y'all need to get those ladders expected. They uh, they work just fine for me. You just gotta get really close to them. What do y'all need? I got a, uh, I gotta go get my body a little bit, uh, you know, cleaned up. I'm dying. You're telling me I just jumped off your roof. <laughs> All right, what? You say you hurt? No, like, I mean, in my head, you know? I gotcha. Yeah. My eyeballs are killing me. Well, you wanna refresh your eyeballs real quick? I, it'll take a long time, you know. I gotta update my eyeballs. I got you. Well, I think I'll, uh, Officer Chin here wants to talk to you. Alright. Hey, Robin. What's up, buddy? Come on. What's up? Come on, buddy. I swear, like, I knew a guy who ate one of these sandwiches got sick. I'm gonna be pissed if I get sick. I wouldn't doubt it. Hey, uh, so uh, you don't work down here, do you? No, I don't. Okay. So. Delivering that car over there. Okay, you hang out down here a lot? Yeah, I'm, I'm decent friends with the, you know, with Roman. Okay, you know anybody else down here? Uh, not really, other than the other owner, but I never really caught a name. I gotcha, I gotcha. Okay, all right. You ever see anything going on down here that you're, you're like, oh man, it's kind of suspicious? Uh, I mean, not uh, not really, but I have noticed he uh, he definitely takes some uh, some phone calls that he definitely want people don't want people hearing. Hey, Roman. Yeah. What about other anybody else here? No, not really. He's usually the only one here, honestly. All right, you good friends with him, like I said? Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty good friends, yeah. We hang out. Okay. Hey, uh, Roman mentioned the other day a guy named, uh, I think it was Cameron. Get rid of the white him? bar on the screen. I don't know what you're talking about, white no, bar on the screen. Cameron. Okay. Yeah, he supposedly hangs out around here a lot. I don't, I don't know. I don't see a white bar. <laughs> Kids are doing great. They're asleep. Anyways, how's, how's y'all's day been going so far? Uh, been going great. There's not a bar in the center. I don't know what yeah, you're talking it's, about. Yeah, it's going. Yeah, they got a lot going on down here in Los Santos. Yeah, yeah, I, I definitely... I don't see a white bar. Get that. I really wasn't expected to get involved with the U.S. Marshals today, but, you know. <laughs> oh, now you're good. We just need to talk to old Roman over there. Yeah. We, we seem to come here a lot. <laughs> Too much. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? All right. Um... <laughs> I was like, I don't see a, a white bar. I have no clue. No. Nah. Who is that anyway? Um, fuck. I never keep care of his name. Is There's he two a, of them. Is he here, like, to get stuff done, or is he working right now? No, I just uh, talked to Nate, and he actually bought that car. I talked to Nate and see if he let me go through him to buy it from him, and he did. Ah, uh, okay. I wanted to give him more than Nate would have gave him 15 grand, so I gave him 55 for it. Hey, qu another question. What can you tell me about Nicky? 
I heard you guys don't like her, so you might as well go ahead, go ahead, tell me some information about her. Ah, uh, let's see. I'll tell you everything you know. I would drugs? definitely tell us. I'm pretty sure she does do drugs. I'm pretty sure. Uh, I think Laren Smith caught her selling them one time. Pretty sure, because I remember them fucking pulling her over like full code five and everything. And then I'm, I'm pretty sure she probably still does it. It was so on. Uh, it was on his phone. She gets her money from. Oh, that's she, right. She don't work here no more, right? Yeah, she don't work here and. She ain't got no job that I know of, and somehow she affords like a two hundred thousand dollar house. Hey, what That's about her stars. husband? You know him? Yeah, I don't. I think he works for the towing company, maybe, but I don't see him buying too much. Who owns the towing company? Um, let's see. I think it's Tony Huff that owns it. I have his contact. Uh, no. Um, he started, he tried to do his own independent, but he didn't have oh, the Jack work. Huff. Jack, Jack Huff? Huff? Okay. Yeah. So Jack Huff. Yeah, he owns it. Hey, Michael Todd, does he do drugs? Michael Todd? Yeah, like, does he sell it or anything? I don't think I even know Michael Todd, to be honest with you. Alright. Yeah, I know, I know, I guarantee Nikki doesn't. She did. All right. She did while she's working here. She don't work here no more. We fired her. I know, but when she did work here, did she do it or do anything suspicious? Um, not that I know of. She never really even worked here, to be honest with you. I think cause she did like one car, and somehow afforded a bunch of shit. Uh, I mean, if you don't mind me asking, uh, you know, why'd y'all get rid of her? Uh, because when we got the shop raided and stuff, she's the only one that I'm pretty sure she snitched on us for what you guys found. Hmm. And no one likes snitches. So, I mean, uh, is that because no y'all do a bunch people. of legal stuff here? Yeah, I should say. No, only Cameron did that one thing and that was it. I don't do anything. I'd rather keep my job and make all this money. I make good fucking money doing what I do. Alright. So what, what do you do? Just fix cars? Yeah, just fix cars. Do the whole nine yards. Trying to get a, uh, trying to figure out if I'd be able to do exhaust work. You know? Hmm. I gotta get teach. So, tomorrow. um, where's Cameron been these days? You been around? Uh, I think Cameron's in a whole different city, you know? I think he's in Florida right now. Okay. Oh, he's trying down, trying to get a tan or something. I think so. Hmm. All right. All right. Well, you tell Hunter that we need to talk to him. All right. Whoever's in the blue you Mustang, they get, need a ticket you know for that big old oil wine. <laughs> like actual oil. I've been trying to find some actual oil. Some you oil? want some what? Like actual oil. Like, 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 like grease, like cooking oil. Trying to fry oil. some chicken? No, engine oil. That's oh, good. engine oil. Yeah, I can't find any. I get, I mean, part uh, sure. I don't know. Uh, I know there's a place called Hayes that that might have some. Hayes, I want to check that out. Yeah. Cause I, I gotta change the oil in my truck, and I can't, I can't find the uh, anyone selling it. Yeah, I, I'll, I'll, uh, I, I don't know, but I, I mean, I'll keep my ears to the streets and let you know. I have a feeling we're gonna be back down here again. To be honest, we're tired of like I don't know what the crap y'all do, but we're gonna find out. But I'm tired of hearing Slipknot come out of every criminal's mouth. Well, we're the only really full custom shop, so I'm not surprised. <laughs> yeah, but I, I mean, yeah, like, custom. <laughs> like, come down here, hey, fix the car. Oh, here's some drugs. I mean, is that what y'all do or did? Is that what people get back because they y'all rip them all? Nah, uh, I don't. We give, I, yeah, I give fairly good prices, I'd say. Like, I give fucking Jack Huff or whatever the fuck his name is. I forgot already. I gave him a good deal on a uh, repair the other day. Okay, well. All right. Well, you tell Hunter we need to talk to him, and uh, you have a good night. Don't do nothing right. stupid and shoot no guns. Hey, I never shoot my gun. 
Only on mountain lions, because they literally try to eat my fucking foot. Uh, wasn't we down here the other day for somebody shooting the gun? Yeah. Yeah, Off well, that, the roof. That, that's Helmet Man. He's kind of, he's retarded sometimes. Well, you need to tell, you, you need to keep, well, are you a manager here? A manager? I'm pretty sure he is the manager. <laughs> No, are you? Are you? Or no, I'm just pretty much the only other worker here. Okay. So, uh, <laughs> when y'all get paid, do y'all get paid in cash or? No, no, not. I don't ever really get paid in cash, but only by customers, because it's a lot easier for them to pay in cash. Oh, so y'all go straight from the customers. You don't go to a company account or anything. No, our co our company account stuff it's still broken. You know. Like it, it don't, it don't give us. It doesn't put the money in the account. You know, whenever we uh we build people, I'd hmm. say that too. All right, hold on. I need to eat something while we're talking because I'm getting really hungry. Y'all make sure y'all eat because if y'all die, I got plenty I don't know of food. Happen. I, when I stock up, I stock up in the. I got one more uh, pocket sandwich. <laughs> oh, I that just sounds nasty. Sandwiches. Oh. I, I got a lot of water. I gotta get some more sandwiches. I'm down to 16. Yeah, my sandwiches get soggy sometimes. It's kind of hot out. All right, well, I guess yeah. I'm gonna head out All up right. here. Yeah, you guys have a good night. All right. All right. <laughs> What's over, this guy? Hey. Uh, keep your nose clean, all right? All right, man. Whatever they do here, you don't do. <laughs> Take it easy. It's a crappy wind anyways. Yeah, I need 10 on it. Dude, I'm telling you. It, 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 <laughs> they're all crooked! Be, that business needs to be shut down. Cops need to be fired. Cartels need to be taken down. People need to stop blind. This city, I swear. The, I, well, at least we don't have to worry about the uh, the the troopers and everything, because they got FBI handling that. Yeah, that's. I guess that gives us a little bit of time to search around. Yeah. Golly. It's just so crazy that every they don't person, he didn't he don't know that that was I guess you don't know your person, uh, <laughs> your handle. I just I just said that to uh <laughs> to your uncle. Oh man, I'm telling you, this is crazy. Yeah, every person we run into, it comes back to the people you know we've been investigating or Slipknot. It's like. To be honest, like everything's going on, Nikki needs to go away. Um, Larry, Smith, um, I mean, definitely them. I mean, because those names come up, everybody, you know. Tell you what, one night when they when we know they're meeting up with a bunch of criminals at Slipknot, we need to go in there with that helicopter and get a big old net, just scoop them all up. Yeah, just scoop them right up. Oh, man, just bring them right to the jail. Just, just, drop, yeah, just them drop them like, you know, just 100 feet up, just let them fall. Yep. Oh, That's my hard, gosh. Man. Yeah, yeah, it is terrible. What we need to do is, like, wonder how uh, how much uh, Nikki uh, Nikki's husband loves her. I don't know, but I feel like the whole treating her as... Like the cartel leader, I think that would work. If we did that, arrests her, get a hold of her husband, and say, "Hey, like your your wife's looking at like going away for life, and like you need to you, you need to you need to help her out, you know." Possibly death penalty. Something Precisely. Like that, yeah. yeah. See if he would you know give us any information. I feel like that'd be the only valid way because I, I mean, want to go by their house. Okay, because she is like deep in that. How do you buy a $200,000 house when you got income? Right. And why don't their funds 
go to a business account like a normal business. I know. They're like, oh, yeah. Because, uh, you know, it, it doesn't, you know, it's, uh, yeah, okay, yeah, okay, yeah, sure. There's always going to yeah. be an excuse, but I'm telling you, the DA's going after them for tax evasion. Yeah, that needs to happen. I feel like if something did, there was an error, they need to go back and they need to look at all the money they've made. And uh, they need to... Uh, they need to uh, get them all back paid or something, you know? Yeah, but see, another thing... when they And now get this them Michael the Todd's one, apparently he's one to open a business here. That's a, dude, they're all crooked, like nothing but crooked businesses, man. I know. But... If they get them for tax evasion, I mean, maybe they can offer a deal to somebody, you know, avoid jail time if you, you know, tell us who's all... He said he out. makes really good money and everything, doing upgrades and everything like that. You're, I mean, only gonna, you're only gonna make so much! Yeah, I mean, he tax free, probably selling drugs. I don't, like, I'm so tired of hearing Slipknot. I really am. That's why I feel like once we get our ducks in a row, we need to shut that place down. Well, hopefully the FBI come up with some stuff. I can't believe I didn't get pulled over on the way down here. Yeah, that cop is still Netflix and like hardcore. Is he still? No, he's out there now. Yeah, he was back there. Well, if he's okay. I don't know. Should we check it out? Maybe we can. Even Hampshire Wheels dirty. Ah, probably. We're gonna be Hampshire Wheels is becoming a parts dealer. Where was it? Oh, right there. Right here, right here, right here. He was on the other side of the road when I did. Well, there's one up here, too. Well, I'll pull over and get you to ask if they're all right. All right. Okay. Oh, just to let y'all know that we, you know, they, uh, that uh, the server we play on, they are accepting applications. Quick, easy, just fill it out truthfully and fill it out fully. That's the best thing you can do. And you can come in and be corrupt too, but then we can come after you. Golly! It's like, I don't know if I've met, uh, I've met an honest cop yet, because they're all corrupt. I'm pretty sure old Dirt, old Needle over there, he's probably the corrupt one ever. He's probably telling everybody what's going on. When I farted in the city hall, he probably told 50 people. <laughs> yeah, he's fine. Trying to get him a speeder. And he's a bonus. Uh, is it? What is that? That is a eighteen. I mean, a semi truck on the guard. <laughs> is that? Is that a local? I don't know. <laughs> uh, I love being crip. <laughs> Tell you, everybody. Uh, it's explanation real deal RP for the. Discord. I actually have to update that because they switched over to Discord, but it's real deal RP. Local. I'm going to just let him be. We'll let him sit there and burn it out. Yeah. Probably, probably what he wants to do anyway. Hey, Joker, are you still in here? Can, well, we you gathered... Post, uh, a little more information, Post one, little by little. A valid one. <sighs> yeah, I mean, to be honest, like, I'm so glad we ain't got to worry about the, the cops. 
because yeah, the cause... FBI is like taking over that. I feel like if we see Nikki, I'm going to pick her up and we're going to arrest her and we'll charge her. Yeah, for sure. And to be honest, like, I don't... You know what we should do? Like, we should tell the... Uh, when we arrest her, tell the wannabe cartel leader, like, hey, we caught the real leader. Like, you can, you know, stop acting. Yeah. Yeah, maybe. Just don't tell them, like... You know, it's her or whatnot. Cause yeah, we'll be in the stream. Her, you know. I think it was pretty good. I think it's been pretty good stream. I've actually I don't know. We'll it. figure it out. There we go. There is the valid link right there. <clears throat> well, that was that was. Hey, I gotta lock my truck. Yeah, I know. It's crazy. Oh yeah, so it's super simple to get in, but you gotta put in the effort. All right, right. If you have a good one, yeah, we're getting ready to it. <laughs> we're getting ready to end it and everything. So thanks for everybody stopping by and everything. I like I, my computer now is telling me I need to end it and everything. Does Frank have a Twitch? Uh, yeah, I went the wrong way. Yeah. All right, they're all full of crap, okay? Like, I'm just saying, they're all full of crap. Hold on one second. Hold on one second. Thank y'all for stopping by and everything. I guess we'll find out if we, we hear anything what's going on. Bumping into me, But I gotta say, I do love investigating. I know it's taking a while to get stuff, but we're, we're learning little by little by little. But we did quote unquote catch a cartel later, but I'm pretty I'm pretty sure it was a it was a, a like a pawn. Again, Fast and Furious, you know, you had that one that was supposed to be the leader, but then it wasn't. It was actually the guy that was on the street. I had room over here on this one. <laughs> Look like you're sitting on the arm. <laughs> it looks like you are sitting on the arm. Alright. Oh, I am sitting on the arm. <laughs> yes, he likes sitting on arms. He likes setting the arms. All right, do we know anything else? No, not else right now. All nothing right. Else right. Well, nothing that we don't already know. Hey, we were talking about Jay Smith and Larry. We were talking about for like Nikki and everything. If we did, you know, do the whole Rico, just you know, peeing everything on her. We were actually yeah. man. To, uh, Nita was talking like, "What if uh, when we did, we call call her husband, and like she's going away for a long time, and like, I mean, maybe we can get him to like kind of you know say something if he loves her, <laughs> right? If he loves her, he'll give her up. Yeah, I like so, that idea. So I don't know, but I do know her name comes up a lot, and she was the one pointing the fingers at." Slipknot, and it seems like everybody else is now, you know? Oh, yeah, everybody is. Something, someone's pissed off at Slipknot. Yeah, I don't know. Hold but... on, hold on, I got a phone call. If you have yet, yeah, make sure to follow on your face right there. old Dirt Slinger. 53 YT's uh, streaming too. Huh? Oh, dirty. Said so you got a little blood on your face right there. That's probably jelly donut. Don't you tell my secrets. <laughs> huh. What's in my desk drawer is my business. Well, that's Watch never good. And... Yeah, you heard that? Is he pulling up? Is he pulling up here? Yeah, I hear something. Oh, great. 
No, I think he went on around. Did he? Why would he come sirens over here? That's pretty dumb. Yeah, I don't know. I think he went. He might have been going down the ramp. Maybe so. I don't know. I think know. he was going down the ramp. Do you play The Sims? Right. Um, I used to. I actually really like The Sims everything. But we are going to end it right here. Thanks for everybody stopping by and everything. And uh, hopefully, I don't know, next time we'll be uh, Marshall or something. I try to, you know, uh, switch it so it's different characters every so often. But if we got anything juicy and stuff Sunday, we will definitely be doing this and everything. But anyways, thank y'all. And I will see y'all in the next one. And as always, woo! <laughs> America, baby!